personal. This ain't even business. This personal. So, Ver, you know what I'm saying? Take it personal, my nigga. If you feel some type of way, do what you do. I'm not here to play with no motherfucking artists. I ain't here for none of that shit. It's all with the nigga here, man. Welcome to URL's Battle Rap Arena with Hip Hop Psycho Jesse Reekin. What's good, son? Here I am on another nigga stage in another nigga's face. I know, I know you saw the trailer, man. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, we actually, you know, it's actually a mashup of what um, Twiz already had done when he um, played it at Known Three, and then they, everybody finally got to hear a nice, good, clean version of. You know them two spitting their bars at each other, which I thought was I, I thought was crazy. And Bird got a loud response in New York. That but, that's the funny part, right? They were booing him right before, but when he did the free throw, for me it's a free throw. For y'all, it's a free show. Yeah, the crowd went crazy. Yo. The crowd went nuts because because again, the crowd isn't biased. They don't like Bird, but they're not biased. They you know you spit some hot bars. They're going to respect that. They respect hot bars, you know, and can't get it now. He was going up in there. He was spitting his shit. You know, he was he was, he was was going in. He didn't even get to finish his bars. You know what I'm saying? It sounded like he had more, and he just stopped because he was a little bit overwhelmed by the crowd reaction and everything. I Yo, but honestly, I just got a strong gut feeling that Arsenal's going to win this show. Like, I, I don't yo. know what that is, man. I really feel like Arsenal's going to win this. <sighs> um, I got. I said it before. I said it again. He got a big mountain to climb just because he's he's battling in St. Louis. I heard in the trailer that you know he, he shouted out St. Louis, and you know he pretty much was trying to you know you know pretty much clean up on some of the things he said in the past and everything. I don't. It, it all depends on how the St. Louis crowd responds to him. Like I, I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna say if he does win, it's gonna have to be on footage. I don't think he's gonna win in the room. I, well, you said the same thing with Kayshawn and Big T. We're going to have Big T on in a little bit. Um, yeah, I did. I did, and, and I was so wrong. I was so wrong right there. Oh, God. But this is this is a little bit different scenario. I was basing that on pretty much how good a performer Kayshawn is in the room. This I'm basing it on the crowd is just not really – I don't think the crowd is really going to be filling Arsenal, and I think they're going to really be – you know, fucking with Verb Heavy, maybe even catching up some of his bars that might not even be as good as some of the other bars he probably has fit that that round. Like, you know, like, I just think Arsenal has got a, a huge mountain to climb as far as trying to beat a Verb in the room. That's just me. I, yeah, Grant, well, this is the one thing that bothered me. I, I told you this early. I was going to bring up something that kind of bothered me about the trailer. Okay. I didn't see no undercard matches. What what are the battles are going on this night? That that's a good question. I really don't have no good answers because you know this is um this whole event is being you know thrown is a smack, smack URL event, but it's is being you know put together by Verb and his people down in St. Louis. So um, I'm not sure exactly sure. I, I, I remember hearing I I believe I remember hearing one matchup. I don't even want to put it out there because I don't want to be wrong. But I think I know about another matchup that's happening down there that's a decent matchup. 
but I'm not, I don't want to, again, I don't want to put it out there because I don't want to be wrong. I don't want to be feeding people improper information. But, um, yeah, I, I, I really do wish they probably did flash a couple of the matchups that they did have for that card if, you know, if they already know. And they should because, they, you know, they're a little bit more than a week left until the card actually happens. Yeah, I, that's the only one thing that bothered me about the trailer. Like, I mean, the Arsenal versus Verb, the freestyle they did, and it it was incredible. Mm -hmm. um, I just wish they would have flashed a few names up there so I could see who else is, who else is battling that night. You yeah, know? I think they got about three or three to four battles lined up. I'm not sure. That, again, I'm not sure exactly who. But I believe he, I believe they got about three to four other matchups besides that one, and obviously that's the main event. Um, we, we'll try to get some more information and give y'all that n um, next week, as far as the other um, matchups that's going to be on that card. And uh, yeah, but I, I, I like the trailer. I, li I like the trailer. Um, if I, I, again, me personally, on a personal level, I'm happy to see Arsenal come back to the URL. I know Jersey bias, whatever. I don't give a fuck. I'm I'm <laughs> I'm happy to see Arsenal come back to the URL because you know I I I I don't know I I I just wanted I just wanted to see him back on this stage. I just, I wanted to see him back on this stage, and I'm I'm happy to see it. I'm happy to get somebody like an Aber who was going who's going to bring some extra attention to the battle, and you know because you know I'm not that he needs. Uh, a verb to battle because Arsenal is actually like his own brand, you know, like he's actually a brand. Like Arsenal is like, you know, uh, a highly touted MC. You know, he gets tr he travels everywhere and battles. You know what I'm saying? So it's like it's not like he needs the extra attention. But again, I'm I'm just happy that he bit the bullet and came over here and decided to do this. I I mean I'm not gonna lie to myself. Like to me, Verb is more like a Mayweather to me. Like I I just want to see him lose. Just, like, <laughs> yeah, we all know you rooting against Verb. <laughs> <laughs> I want Arsenal to be the one. That, like I, I could, I could see Arsenal giving them that L, just like Mayweather's going to take against Alvarez yeah, September. We're not going to talk about that right now, Jesse. Uh, we're not. No, no, we're not going to talk about that. But I'm just saying, like I want, I want, like I, if anybody's hired to do the job to kill Verb in his own hometown, Arsenal will be that dude to do it. And I mean, like. I'm 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 always happy to see Verb lose. So, I mean, Arsenal's capable of doing it. He's capable, but you know, again, it's not going to be easy. I don't think I don't think um, Arsenal's going to be an easy win for Verb. I, I don't think that's going to be. Easy. I think it's, I think it's going to be it's an interesting matchup, kind of a clash of styles because you know Verb is more of a lyricist when Arsenal is more of a aggressive, disrespectful type of cat. Like so, like yeah. It's, 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 it's interesting. I, I'm interested to see how it's going to happen. I, I know it's going to be some shots taken in this battle. I'll be surprised if it wasn't. There's going to be some shots taken. There's going to be some certain angles that's going to be taken. I'm sure they ain't going to shock people when they hear them, you know. But, it, it, you know, I'm just, I'm just interested to see what transpires throughout the course of this battle. It's going to be, yeah, I, I'm I'm real interested to see. And I'm, Again, I'm excited to see this happen. It's a nice little... It's a nice little warm up to Summer Madness Three that's going to be coming in late August, and you know, for all the people out there, I I know about three matchups so far that's already laid out. I can't obviously, I'm not going to put it out there right now. Sorry, people, but I know about three matchups that that signed up to go down, and they're they're crazy matchups so far. Uh, I know a lot of people was wondering whether or not the known three card was going to get topped. And Summer Madness 3, so far, so good. That's all I can say. So far, so good. You know, the there whole card isn't mapped out yet, but it will be shortly. And, yeah, yeah I, we'll, 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 trust me, you know, y'all know to stay tuned in. Y'all know we'll keep y'all uh, up to date and posted to, you know what I mean, what's up and coming for that epic event that I'm, you know what I mean, at least I'm expecting it to be an epic event. Why wouldn't it be? All Every other, every Summer Madness seems to top the, the previous one, so I'm not expecting this one to be different. Yeah, I I, I agree with you 100%, yeah. Um, and URL Summer Madness, this is the WrestleMania, this is whatever you want to call it, the 
the single Super Bowl. That, the Super Bowl, single that Mayweather for the boxing fans like uh, you and this. <laughs> Go ahead. This, this is the one though, man. Like, don't like don't miss Summer Madness Street. Whatever you do, don't miss Summer Madness Street. Yeah, I, that's all I can say is, if you miss Known Three, shame on you already. <laughs> but mm. don't miss Summer Madness Street. Yeah, you know. So, yeah, I'm I'm expecting the same type of production for some man of three, maybe even possibly better, you know, because the production for Gnome 3 is hands down the best production URL has ever had, you know, from, like, I don't think anybody will question that. And I'm expecting some man of three to have that same style of production, possibly even better, more detailed. And, yeah, like, people are going, you know, people are going to be out there working, man, to get you all the best product that you all possibly can see on online. You know what I mean? You know, that, that's what URL does. You know, we, we get up here, you know, we try to always outdo ourselves. Like, the way, way we see it, we, we are our, our best competition. So, you know, so every time we a bit gets thrown, we try to figure out a way, how can we top this? How can we top this? We're always looking to get better. You know, it, it, you know URL has been around for almost four years now. And, he, and you Smack's know, been around for longer than that, by the way. Yeah, well, Smack, yeah, obviously, Smack has been been around longer than that with the DVD DVD era. But um, you know, again, it, it's a learning process, and each time a event gets thrown, it, we to take another step up. You know what I'm saying? So that's what it is, and I'm, I'm not expecting some matter three to be any different, any different. So uh, yeah, you um, I'm about to see if I can try to get our guest on right now. I'm gonna yeah, take a call, a call real call quick while I it, I guess. Uh, let's see. 424, four, four, you there? Yo, 424. Four, 424? Four. Alright, go, go okay, to the next caller real quick. Oh, God, <laughs> let me get this out of the way right now before we get Big T. 718, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. you there? 718? Seven, 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 okay, 718 bullshitting too. <laughs> you can go. I'm glad. <laughs> let's go. Uh, 917, you there? Yo. Yo, what's yeah, good? Man. Chillin', chillin', man. Yeah, I had a question for Big T and shit. Oh, we're um, gonna I have him on in a second, man. What, 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 what's on your mind? What's going on? So, no, um, I just wanted to holler at y'all because I went to the Nova event and shit. And, like, um, I was in the VIP and shit, and I really didn't have a good spot. Like, I couldn't see nothing. You know what I'm saying? So I wanted to know, like, what time do you think I should go for a summer madness to, like, you know, secure my spot so I can get, a, you know, so I can enjoy the battles better? I, I mean, I don't understand your question. So, so you could get, go to get a spot online? No, just a spot in the club, man, because that shit was crazy. I couldn't see shit, my dude. I couldn't see nothing. It was my first time VIP, and that shit was mad. Like, it was calm, yo. It was so packed up in there, I couldn't see nothing. I mean, if you, I, I, I think, I think it pretty much depends on how soon you get there. Not even how soon you get to the club, because the first people at the door aren't the first ones to hit the stage. Sometimes they hit the bar, sit around for a while. So I mean, that it all depends on that, though. But I mean, I, I mean, I don't know what else to tell you. Get there early. Get to the stage early. Alright, hold down. I'm looking back. Yo, if y'all can talk to you with T there, I got a question for this shit. Well, JT, what's up? What, what do you want to talk to Big T about? I want to know who is who's his ex-opponent. What? And two, why even battle more? He only battle like once a year, like. You know what I'm saying? I think he should battle more. Yeah, that's a good question. We're waiting for Psycho to get him on. Um, yeah, I mean, like, Rex had that question for him, too, and I feel like that's a valid point that Rex has. Um, when I asked Rex, would you battle Big T? Rex was pretty much like, I mean, I'm not going to battle somebody that battles once a year. You know? Mm. I feel like it's, it's pretty much because he's sitting on his best material while Rex is wasting material. So it's kind of like, is it fair? Does it give him an unfair advantage? Yo, Seiko, we got you there? 
Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. Big Key actually needs a little bit of time. He's charging his battery up for his phone, so we. Uh, oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. We, uh, um, we gotta wait a little bit before we get him on. Um, so we're gonna take some fan calls until while he's doing that. Uh, let's see, six five one. You there? Yeah, I'm right here. Yo, what's up, guys? How's it going? Colin, Colin, what's the word? Yeah, yeah. Um, yes, yeah, so I, I just wanted to say, why are you guys always letting this guy Mickey Fax come on here and talk crap about uh, Big T? Why do we let? What do you mean? Why do we let him come on here? <laughs> that dude's I mean, a you clown. Know, that dude's a clown. He, that dude's a clown. He he has one recorded battle. He he shouldn't even have an opinion I, on this. I, I, I feel you, but, you know, I mean, like, you know, we don't censor our guests, you know, like, Big T's about to come on now. I have no idea what he wants, you know what I mean, what he's going to say when he comes on here, but we ain't going to censor him, you know. It's not well, like no, I mean, just, I, I got you, but that's like me telling you guys how to run a radio show, you know. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I just think the dude's a clown, and Big T would body him if it ever happened, but, you know, Mickey Fax, he just talks shit and then, you know, never does anything. Yeah, that so. battle ain't going to happen. Unfortunately, it's not going to happen. I was actually looking a little bit forward to seeing that battle a little bit, but, you know, now I, I, I lost a little bit of interest in that battle now, especially now that the rounds are starting to get leaked out and everything. So, like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, anyway, what what man, did you I, think about Mickey's second round? You talking to me or talking to Psycho? Uh, he was talking no, I was to talking to you. What, what did you think uh, about Mickey's second round? Yeah, I mean, it was okay, but I thought the only good stuff was, you know, the stuff that he basically stole from Big T and did in, in his style, you know? I think Big T would have bodied him, you know? Yeah, I, I mean, I kind of felt the same way. I don't I don't and, think... And, um, and, and he, also, he also wasn't performing in front of a live crowd, you know? He was doing it in the comfort of his own home on the telephone, you know? So that's another reason, you know? But... Anyway, I, I came all the way from Minnesota just to go to Gnome 3, had a great time, so I just wanted to thank you guys, and uh, thank you, R.L., for that, so. All right, all right. Psycho, we got, we got the next call, Psycho? Hello, Psycho. You? Yeah, yeah you? Psycho, we lost you there? Yeah. Yeah, I'm here. I, I got our special guest oh, got... on right now. Uh, Big T, what's going on? Welcome to URL Bell Rap Arena again. What's good? What's the deal? What's the deal? What's cool the it, deal? Man. What's going on? Yo T, I, yo, T, I picked you this time, yo. I picked you this time. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Jesse got me, Jesse got me out of here. Got me out. I picked... I picked you against Dot Mob. You got me in Dot Mob trouble, yo. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh see, you, you was right this time. You know what's crazy is I look nervous when you pick me. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm yeah, serious. Big you know like, that yo, Jesse you know, it, it, it was almost like a jinx. Like, I was just making a vibe. And, and like, yo, Big T, you know I picked you this time. I'm like, oh, man, he about to kill me. <laughs> oh, you, oh, you, you, you thought it was a game plan. You thought Rex came up to me. He was like, yo, pick Big T. <laughs> I was like, all right, I got you. <laughs> what happened? You thought it was a game plan. You thought that mom came up to me and they were like, yo, pick Big T. And I was like, all right, I got you. <laughs> yeah, I thought y'all was at me. I thought it was some type of weird, you know, some shit. Yeah. So Big nah, T man, but, um. My yeah. bad. Go ahead, Psycho. I was about to say, Big T, you know, like, you know, the uh, Known 3 trailer dropped, and, you know, it, right. it had everybody buzzing and everything, and w w the biggest buzz I heard off the trailer since the trailer dropped was, you know, your your um, bunny ears, Peace Behind the Head line. Like, <laughs> it, it got Peace everybody going head. crazy. Like, you know, everybody's saying that's, like, you know, the best line of the trailer, you know, everybody's hearing right. your, about your great performance you had on Gnome 3, you know. Mm -hmm. you got, me me mm -hmm. personally, I felt like your first round was a classic round. Might have been might have yeah. been one of the best rounds you ever spit in that day and something. And, um, right. like, um, what, how did you feel about the performance? Like, what, what was your mindset going into it and during my, and after? My mindset, um, kind of, um... I don't know, man. I just I just went at it, man. Like 
I thought K. Shine was good. I thought he was on the street, but it was like I, I don't want to be cocky, and I don't want people to say I'm with, like I'm cocky, but I just didn't think it was too much he could do with me. Mm -hmm. Honestly, I just you know I knew he was aggressive, you know what I'm saying. But then I'm looking bar for bar, no wordplay, no, you know what I'm saying. Switch up mm -hmm. the flow, no, you know what I'm saying. But yeah. He didn't really have it that night. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to be uh, right. I'm going to be real. I was kind of disappointed in this time. Mm-hmm. I didn't get the fight I wanted. Like, well, one of, one of the things I did say on the show before the battle even happened is uh, I felt like Tayshawn had wasted the, um, everybody with Big has an R.I.P. attached to it. And, and, and he said right. it with Big Will. And I, I felt like... Right. If he would have said that against you for the first time, that would have been a killer line. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, he already battled a big guy, and it's like he when he already drained this shit out. Exactly, and um, we we just had a conversation before you came on, and it was kind of like, do you feel like maybe battlers shouldn't take as many battles as they should? Because I mean, you you always go up there and put a classic performance. My bad, go ahead. No, that little rebel shouldn't take this many what's name. The reason why I'm saying like this is I'm walking. I'm in Detroit right now. But yeah, the reason why um I don't think battle should take because they oversaturating themselves, man. You know what I'm saying? Like surf seat you shouldn't do, man. Let the crowd build up for you. Build some anticipation of yourself. These guys going in month after month and they and they sounding dry. They sounding empty. They yeah, sounding like they, empty. Like they barred out. Yeah, like they, like now they forcing it. You know what I'm saying? Like, like nowadays people not even wanting to win. They want debatable. You know what I'm saying? These nowadays, yeah. this is what are we going against? Mm. Yeah, yeah. It's almost Word. like it's almost like now the mindset from a lot of people is like if it's a if if I made it debatable, I won. That like that's like right. And like as long as I make it debatable, you know, I'm good. And it's like, I, I kind of feel right. what you're saying. Like, it's almost like people ain't going with the mindset like they're going in to win. Yeah, they good with that. They good with that. Um, people good. Like, let me get one round. My fans will make it debatable. Nah, I ain't like that. I, I'm a champ. I want to kill you. I want yeah. blood. I don't, I don't want nobody to, to even have a thought in their mind if they beat me. Like, oh, I beat Big T. Nah, yeah. hell no. Now... Like I said, your first round was incredible. It was a, yeah, uh, it was the first. It was the best round of the night at the time when I heard it. Until I heard Hitman's first round, and I, I had to push yeah. it down to number two. But it still was a great round. And um, it, it, um, your second round, you um, you, had, okay. you you lost the crowd a little bit in the second round. I believe. Yeah, I yeah, yeah. I had, I had a line. All, all yeah, it was second round. I had a line, but. I think it just went over their head more than being whack. Because if you watch it, the crowd, people going to look stupid because they booed me for something that was actually nice. Because you, you heard Mickey. Mickey said it uh -huh. like that he got booed for something they shouldn't have booed him for. Yeah. I, I think, I think honestly, I think they was trying to get Shine something. You know what I'm saying? Like, okay, mm -hmm. let's get him this second round, to be honest. But I start throwing haymakers. Boom. Yeah. Throw another one. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah. Look at me now. You know what I'm saying? And I got the yeah. crowd back. Yeah, that that was going to be my question. I was, you know, was, was going to say when it happened. Time being you, okay. It was my first yeah, time being booed, but I, I handled it like a champ. You feel that me? So I'm good with that. Seen, yeah, that was the first time I actually ever seen you boo. That's why I was about to ask you, like, is that like, did it throw you off a little bit off your game? But you said you, you got focused and got back on your shit and everything. And yeah, you got the crowd back. You definitely got the crowd back, right. and you came back in the third round, and you you pretty much finished K. Shine off. And like, um, yeah, I I have to agree with you. K. Shine disappointed me. I I I, I yeah, you know, I, I don't know what it was up. I don't know what was up with him. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna take nothing away from my victory, of course, but he just wasn't. He didn't bring a fight that I wanted. You know what I'm saying? But I knew. I'm honestly, I knew from the first couple lines I had him. Mm -hmm. Yeah. When he yeah, said that. zip him up that first time, if y'all gonna watch the camera, I look at my people like, 
Oh, it's over. Because, you know, like, I study Shine. Like, I study this battle shit. Shine is not a person that, other than the DNA battle, he got better with round. Usually Shine mm. come out with everything he got and decrease. Like, yeah. he come out, bang, 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 round one, round two, mm. uh, round three, he's damn near like he just rapping. Yeah. I, I, speaking but, of DNA was the first DNA, time. Were you? My bad, go ahead. I'm here, I'm listening. No, speaking of, speaking of the DNA battle, were you were you worried that Shine would bring out a prop, or were you like, was your mind more like, well, I, I'm just focused on my rounds. I don't care about his. Yeah, I was pretty much focused on me. Like, like Shine had his little props. They was dope. It was um, you know, I was just focused on me. I wasn't really worried about what the next person do, even when I battle anybody. You can't really worry mm-hmm. about the next dude, dude. Yeah, that you got true. nothing, no control of. You got no control of what he do, so you got to come with your best shit. And I know if I come with my best shit, ain't nobody fucking with me. Period. Yeah, I, I, I feel you. That's the mindset you're supposed to have. Real talk. Right. Um. Right. So you um you you you, you had this battle. You know, you got a lot of positive feedbacks off this battle and everything. And uh-huh. um, I, we, we had we had a show not too long after Known 3, and, you know, a caller actually just mentioned it, and, you know, Mickey Facts crashed the show because I believe, I, if I'm mistaken, I think <laughs> Noah, we, Noah, we, it was, it was, um, Noah had made a comment talking, and so I think a caller had asked um, what happened to that battle. And Noah's made a comment saying Mickey's right. lucky that he didn't take the battle because he thought that you would kill Mickey. And then Mickey hears it, hears oh, about yeah. it on Twitter and everything, and he calls in the show, and then he, he drops his second round that he had prepared for you. I think he also got a, a blog right. coming up with his first round that's also going to be dropping. Okay. Like, did, did you did you hear the second round on the show and everything? Like, what was your opinion on it? Uh, I heard him rap. Yeah, I heard him. Yeah. good. His rounds was good. I can say it was better than Shines, but <laughs> I wish I could put my rounds together to, to show y'all what I had for Mickey. Like, Mickey yeah. rounds was him like, oh, boy, I know what to do. Like, I say, okay, that was some pretty nice bars, but they was kind of on a PG level, if you ask me. No dudes. Mm. It was kind of like a, it was kind of like I'll be battling the proof around dude. Mm. Can, can you give us a round? Can you give us a round you have for Mickey? I don't got nothing. Like, I don't have it where, uh, when it, there ain't nobody ever solidified a battle, so yeah. I never had it where gotcha, I remembered gotcha. it. But I uh, knew, I, I got pieces that I can kind of, that I can't really recite, but if I put it together, yeah. I know I had at least two solid rounds for Mickey. Oh, okay. All right. Since we did that, because some of Madden's three could have went down. Yeah. Yeah, could have. When he did that, he threw the battle out the window. Do you think it's his fault that y'all two not battling? Um, um, no, nah, I think it's, 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 it, I don't know. When he threw, when he threw the round out, yeah, it's his fault. Mm-hmm. When he did that, he, he kind of fucked it up. Yeah. When I heard him, when I heard they was like, oh, Mickey Specs get his round. I'm like, what are you doing, man? Yeah. Uh, I, I thought he should have kept the rounds, too, because it kind of, like, yeah, like never you said, let it kind of ruined any bro. possible never, battle in the future. Never let your pistol go. Never let it go. Keep that. You never know when you're running to me. Yeah. Unless he can gear <laughs> up again. Unless he can gear up again, and we can still fight, but he going to have to do better than what he had. Okay. I, now i got to ask this. Now. After, after um, again, after Known 3 with your battle with Kayshawn, Dot Mob member, we all know that right. wasn't really the Dot Mob member that you actually was looking forward to even stepping in the ring with. There was another Dot Mob like member who you've been going back <laughs> like, and forth with. Like yeah, I said on Twitter, year. like I said on Twitter, Rex is the reason why Shine got killed. He put his man out there in the street, and them bullets weren't even meant for Shine. I like Shine. I had nothing against Shine. It was more meant for Rex. The anger I gave out on Shine, I made an example out of him. Let's put it like this. No bullshit. What got my member you know ever got beat that bad? Yeah, that's a good question. 
When, when have you ever seen Dot Mom quiet on stage? Y'all was there. That's, that's another good question. I, it was no <laughs> get that nigga shot. None of that. I was going over there pointing at niggas' faces. Like, I, I, I was rapping like I lived there. Yeah. Yeah, you was real comfortable on that stage. That's another thing I got to give you credit right, for. Right, they, they was over there. I actually, uh, you, I actually, they, oh, go ahead. No, nah, go ahead, go ahead, go on my bad. No, I was just gonna say I actually I actually had to stop and and give you some credit because I, I you know I was I was one of the people that was wondering how you was gonna do on a big stage. I know this is the biggest stage you ever been on, and yeah, you handled yourself right. real good up there. You was real yeah, comfortable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But but like, like I said with that, like people don't understand. Like in this battle game, there's certain people that zone out. Like I'm a person that zone out. So if it's hello. Did we lose him? Did we lose him? Um, we might have lost him. I'm gonna see yeah. if I can get him back online. Yeah, see if you can get a call. Uh, we'll get a caller real quick, and yeah, hopefully yeah. the battery then die neither. All right, let's go. Uh, five seven zero. You there? You there? Hello. Five seven zero. Uh, go to the next call. Let's go. Um, nine one seven. You there? Hello. Yeah. Yeah. What's up, man? Yo, what's going on, y'all? Cool, and cool, and what's the deal? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, hopefully, I can get Big T, um, Big T, uh, back on the line real quick while I'm on the line, cause there's something I wanted to say to him directly. Like, I, I just wanted to know how you felt about, um, I mean, I, he, he kind of just voiced his opinion on the Mickey round, but, um, I don't know. I think people are sleeping. Some of that shit was real heat. Like that shit was. Some of that shit was heat. I think. Well, Mickey round. I think niggas just hate him, bro. Uh, on YouTube especially, like, cause all the comments that it's a pattern. All the comments were like, "Oh, his round, his round, his round was whack." Yeah. And all those was, comments, it's, "Oh, he's a mainstream nigga. He can't fuck no, with no, us." No, you know, nobody shit like said. That. Nobody said it was a whack. Nobody said it was a whack round. But nah, I'm mean, not talking about y'all. I'm not talking about y'all. Yeah. Okay. Okay. But yeah, you're that was some general. real heat. Yeah, I'm speaking in general, like. That was some heat like that when he was like, um, but I will talk about how niggas shot and you ain't shoot bad. Like, that shit was, that angle was crazy. I, I didn't think of that angle. But, um, I yeah, mean, I have a question. I think it was, All right, I, bad, I, yeah, Justin. Yeah, Justin. I think there was a few lines that just, like, I, I think when Mickey, like, basically when Mickey said, oh, you're going to stand there and not do nothing, you're Mickey Facts. Like, the URL crowd is not trying to hear you, punk. Um, I I don't know if that would go over too well in the URL crowd. There was a couple right. lines in in in, the, in in Mickey's round. There, there was another line or two, but I I, re, I remember that one stuck out to me as I I felt like if I was in the audience, it it wouldn't have been receptive. You know what I mean? Right, right, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I now when I heard it. I mean, that seemed like that seemed like it was geared. That sounded like it would be an interesting like mixtape song angle topic, like you know, rapping outside yourself. Mm -hmm. I didn't think it would go over too well in 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 the um like like battling him, but I feel like for him to like be writing shit like that and the songs that he writes, I mean, yeah, that was some real heat for him. For him, that was heat. And especially when he, you know, that, that Chalaka Blue shit, that shit was hot. That shit was hot. But, um, do y'all think Sean at 100% could have beat Big T? Because Sean is my favorite of, above everybody. I, I know I'm in the minority, but what, what something just at, tells me he's a wild card. Like, like I, I feel like there's certain battle rappers in the URL that on a regular day, they're not the best, but in their bag, you, you, there's certain people I that you can't 100. beat. I think at a hundred percent he could have made it debatable, but Big T. Nah. Big T was on top of his died. game that day. I uh, mean, Big I T, hear you, but I don't know, man. Who? Big T was on top of his Look, game that day. That I he was hard to beat that day. I put it this way: one of Shine's best attributes is performance. T got booed, so even if it was debatable, people would go to YouTube. That round that T got booed, they gave it to Shine. And uh, if Shine got booed, Shine would have beat Big booed. T's first round, though. I don't know if he would have beat Big T's first round. Let's just say, Big, uh, let's just say, let's play devil's advocate and say, 
um, big um, um, Kayshawn, um, you know, one round two and everything else. But round three, I, nah, I don't, I don't know, I don't know. He could have made it debatable. I don't think he, I don't think I mean, he would have crushed him or anything like that. Like, no, no, he could have made it debatable. You're not gonna crush Big T, no, unless choked by. I think he could have clearly because what was the talk when he was facing DNA? Uh, no, Shine can't get lyrical. Shine is all performance, which I don't, I don't, I don't feed into the hype to begin with. Like I personally never thought that. Like the same thing when people say Hitman Holla is all performance. Like I don't feed into that shit because if you compare someone like Mass, Mass is lyrical. I fuck with Mass. Shout out to Hopper Brooklyn, but Mass bars are not crazy like 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 that. He's a great battle rapper though, top five for sure. But when people say that. I just don't think, and the same thing with T-Rex. I think Rex is good at being very consistent and fast. That That's what people like about him. But none of them are, like, complex, like, looks. So why do people say that? Like, like performance, like, it man's all performance. That kaboom shit was hot. Any way you put it, even if he, even if he wouldn't have fell back and did the whole theatric shit, that shit was hot on its own. Yeah, the the, the 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 falling back and everything like you know, Hitman is a com- like he's a combination of everything. So you know, like I, I thought he I thought he right. did it perfect myself. Like that that's what Hitman does. Hitman Hitman will take like I said, he's he's the master of taking a bar that might not hit as hard, and he'll do something yeah. extra to it and make it hit ten times harder. You know what I'm saying? So like he he's, yep. he's master at that. To, to me, the best performer. If you're just talking straight performance, he's the best performer in the URL. And, okay. you know, like, you know, that his first round was crazy. Him and Big T had two best first, had two best rounds, period, of that night. Speaking of which, we yeah. actually got Big T back on the on the line. Big T, you there? Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. Oh, oh okay. We, I thought we lost you, T. <laughs> yeah, y'all did for a second. Y'all did for a second. I made it back in the, um, just in the nick of time. Oh, I, you know, I thought you were ducking the show the way you be ducking Rex. Oh, well, shots fired. <laughs> see, see there how he softened you up in that team? He's talking like he was, like he was one of his favorites and everything else. And see how he just came in and just... <laughs> nah, no, dude, man, just, I, he's I, one I, of my favorites. Oh, no, man, I want to come... But just, I don't... I, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> Jesse, Jesse right. Luck was on that night, man. Maybe he was just on that night. He came right before me. Yo, Big T, I'm voting for you. I said, shh. <laughs> you should have seen the you should have seen the look I gave him. Like, oh my god, come on! <laughs> so, so are you still so you still interested in battling Rex? Um, not as much, not as much. You know what I'm saying? I I don't really like how they sent the um innocent man out there to get killed like that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know, I don't I don't like the way they did that because you know what I'm saying. The reasons why Rex didn't battle me, he should have told his boy the same way, same thing. Like, man, don't do this, don't do this, this. but nah, he gonna let he gonna let me unload on his boy? You think that's mm-hmm. right? What type of mob move like that? <clears throat> uh, I know. Like mob move like that? That's the question, what I'm saying. Um, oh, yeah, and you, um, I was talking to probably your biggest fan. I know the biggest fan of yours that I personally know. You um, tell the barber. <laughs> he he That's definitely my boy. wanted me to That's ask my you. Man. He, he, yeah. he, he, he lined me up before the battle. Every battle, I, if I need to tell, tell the barber line up. Every battle. Oh, hands down, you his favorite. Chicago for our battle. Yeah, hands down, you his favorite. Hands down. <laughs> and, um... He wanted me to ask you, like, who who do who do you want next? Who is next? Like, if you were to if you were to step on that summer madness three stage coming up at the end of August, who would you want to be sitting right there in front of you, right there with a the coin flip? Like I said, I, I I'm obviously not gonna get who I want. Um, really, I want I want something that right now I haven't done yet. I haven't killed a smack legend, somebody from the smack era. So I need mm-hmm. that on my resume. I need somebody oh, okay. from the smack era, from the from the, what, what, the golden years. I need one of the golden girls. <laughs> I, re- I remember last I year you tweeting that, like you, Mookie, that you would be interested Mookie. in getting in the ring with Jay Mills. Would you still be interested Jay in that? Mills? that oh, that would be lovely. 
That'd be lovely. That'd be lovely. If he any yeah, that 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 that's the fight that I really want. You know, the fight that ain't nobody else had. You know, Mook, Mookie already jumped in the ring with a safe fight last year, and we saw he mm-hmm. wasn't the same. You know, I, mm-hmm. I, we don't know what Jay Mills is. Don't nobody know if he's better or is he worse. So mm-hmm. that will be something that I like to test. Because really, when I be battling these dudes, I don't be having no format. Like, I don't have no somebody I can look at and be like, oh, this is how you beat him. I, I got to beat him my own way. With clips, like, I didn't have no format on clips. I had yeah. to, you know, because cause at first, clips was almost considered the dude that never lost a round. Remember, he was mm-hmm. he was the guy that, yeah. before he battled me, you know, clips doing his thing, you know, let's, let's, let's not keep it there. But before he battled me, clips was the guy that looked at, had unblemished, like, mm-hmm. he walked away every battle untouched. Now, it's like, hold on, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm showing people the way. You know, even if people say he beat me or not, which I don't see how they say that, but now people got a format for clips. Didn't nobody mm-hmm. have one at first. And, and you know, Clip Clip said something um, in another interview where he said he felt like Sirius Jones was the first one to make him taste his own blood. I got to disagree with that. I think it was you. I think yeah, you was the yeah, first he, one. He definitely, cause... No, go ahead. What you say? Go ahead. My bad, bro. Go ahead, my baby. No, right, no, finish, finish your thought. What you saying? No, like, yeah, of course. Like, like you battling, man. We know we both battlers. Me and Clips. We both battlers. Clips was mm-hmm. buckling. I seen Clips' face. Like, I was in Chicago. I, I seen him. I seen him pulling down his little tricks that he never normally did. Clips never stuttered before. Never nothing. You know what I'm saying? This, this Clips couldn't. Really, he, he he wasn't really prepared for that. But he he was prepared. I could say he wasn't prepared. He did what he had to do. But this is the first time anybody seen Clips buckle. Like, oh, my God. Like, hold on. This guy ain't scared of him. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying nobody that battled him before was scared of him, but I went in there with a different mentality than everybody else. Like, I went in there with the whole thing of he's not as experienced as me. He haven't seen what I've seen in battling, you know, so I don't care what he did in O two, O three, whatever, when he was battling Mook on a playground or battling Jay Mills on a swing ball set. I, I didn't care about none of that. Mm-hmm. I just went in and did what I had to do. You know what I'm saying? You can't care about people past, man. Can't really think yeah. about it. I, I totally agree. I totally agree. But I... I definitely is anxious to see you get back in this ring and see who you're going to be facing possibly. I heard some names thrown out there. Um, I had a name thrown to actually, no, actually I thought of this name. I can't even get nobody credit for this. (laughs) Would you you be interested in battling somebody like a K-Rock? K-Rock? Yeah. I don't know. Not really. Not really. Um, how about an old red? No, like like I said, like I said, like I said, anybody else that would probably I'll be battling would probably be just because you're gonna be a, you're gonna be another innocent victim because I'm want to battle. I want to get the somebody else is gonna look shiny on my resume. I want the smack. Mm-hmm. I want the golden years. Any uh, nobody from the golden years is safe. None of the golden girls safe. Sirius Jones not safe. Murder Mook not mm-hmm. safe. The reason why I said T Rex because T Rex one of the Golden Girls too. He not safe, you know what I'm saying? Jay Mills, none of those guys. Lux, none of those guys. What about Jesse's favorite Golden Girl, um, Reed Dallas? <laughs> oh, Jesse that's loves just, Reed Dallas. I mean, you know, me and Reed Dallas just me and Reed, me and Reed Dallas just had an exchange of words the other day, man. He kind of was kind of. Upset, I was like, Reed Dollars, what's up? And he kind of, you fat nigga, this, this, this. I like you, Big T. I, out of all the niggas, I like you. You know what I'm saying? But I was mm-hmm. like, bro, you know, you can get killed. I know you, you know what I'm saying? You might or whatever, but anybody from the Golden, any one of the Golden Girls could go. How about how about an old Red? Old Red, you know, that name been tossed around to me a lot lately. Mm-hmm. <sighs> I don't know. We'll see, man. We'll see. You know, I'm I'm the streak stop anyway, man. A red been on this little streak. K Shine's on this streak. You know, I'm the streak mm-hmm. stop anyway, so I don't know. I might I might want to continue stopping people streaking. Go back into hibernation. 
<laughs> now, you, you said one line. Can I touch yo, on the yo, line? Yo, 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 big two the there, hibernation. Go ahead. Yo, that's, yo that's, the, that's the name 50 called me, man. I don't know why, man. I, I went to, um, I don't know if I ever told y'all this. I ain't told about the story. I, I ran into 50 recently. You know, he mm-hmm. came up to me and shit. I went to this is 50. He was like, yo, that's my nigga right there. Yo, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm thinking, like, you know, Smack and Chico say 50 fuck with me heavy, but, like, I didn't know that 50, like, really is into it. You know what I'm saying? You like, Big T the bear. I'm like, the bear? But, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's cool. But, mm-hmm. yeah, I do be hibernating, come out once a year and kill something. You know, <laughs> you know, right? You really from Chicago. <laughs> You is from Chicago. So, <laughs> yeah, from Chicago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so I guess I guess it kind of fit. It kind of fit, you know. So yeah. Yeah, you also you also fifty favorite too, right? Yeah, fifty. Yeah, fifty favorite. That's a good look yeah. too, you know. Shout yeah. out to um fifty. Shout out to fifty cent, the big homie. Shout out to Nelson over I- there, you know. And my people. Every time I come out there, I go to this is fifty. They stay. They just don't put up my battles. They play my music all the time. G on the radio. All that. you know what I'm saying. So that's, what's up. Uh, that's family over there. That's family as far as I'm concerned. What you think he might be interested in signing you one day? Um, who knows? Who knows? You know? Who knows? Yeah. You know, we just we just talk cord on the cordial level. You know, we ain't really get in the business. You know, it's a time and a place for everything. Right now, we mm-hmm. just feeling, you know, just saying what's up, like what up, you know, vibe. Yeah. You know, just talking. You know, he sat down, talked to me for like an hour, forty five minutes, just you know how he came up. He ain't have to do that, you know. He That's a good look. You know, this, this a million dollar nigga. He, you know, what I'm saying he could have went on about his business, but he sat and he conversated with me on the how the battle game is, how music, how I should market it with that. Like, he didn't have to tell me none of that. So, you know, I listened. I damn near pulled out a pen and paper. <laughs> Word. That's what's up. That's what's up. up. That's definitely a good look. You know what I mean? Um, mm-hmm. I know you used to drop your music all the time. Like, you used to drop, like, a song a week. All now, you going to go back into doing that? All the time. Big T Tuesdays. Nah, I ain't stopped doing that. I, I kind of worked on my project with my group. I've been working on my quiet money project, and I've been basically touring around with Bizarre lately. So I really kind of been just shooting the jump shot as I'm working on battles at the same time. So I'm kind of like multitasking. I can't put my hundred percent into everything, you know. Yeah. Like even with the battle, like I feel like I okay, I beat K Shine, I you know three old them or whatever they want to say. I feel like if somebody's gonna catch me slipping, that was the night to catch me slipping. Mm. That was the night to catch That's you crazy that yeah, you said that's the night to catch you slipping. That's, that's crazy. the night right there because 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 I made mistakes that night. I made mistakes mm. that I know. You know, people probably don't know, but I made mistakes that night. That that's the night that if Sean was to beat me or somebody, that was gonna happen. But now, it's over. I know what to do. You know, mm. I know what to do. I actually and wanted I think to ask you a question. question. My bad. Go, go ahead. ahead. No, uh, I, I, can I say can I say one of the lines that you said during that battle or no? Oh um, yeah, it's up. Shit, it, okay. It's up to you. Um, that, okay, no, cool. I like I thought, I thought it was a real creative angle the way you said that. Like um, when you mentioned the whole Lux situation, how uh, well, Lux yeah. gave a real black uh black people a yeah. positive message, well, and then you said well, I'm about to do the opposite of that. Like I thought, yeah. I thought you were about to give Calico props. I thought you were gonna say, "Yo, I thought Calico won," but nah, you were like, "Yo, that was a good look for Battle Rap." He gave, and then I was like, "I mean, how did you come up with that angle?" And it's like, was that a shot at Lux? Is or it was, was that? It, just... it was kind of, it was kind of a shot at everything. Kind of like it was a kind of shot at Lux as far as you know. Battle Rap isn't about compliments. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is about insults. You know what I'm saying? So, so everybody, he got people who also on a positive, like, man, you should be talking about how good your brother was or, or how good your father should have been a better father figure. This is not really what we're about. We're talking about, nigga, how ugly your father is, how you know what I'm your mother ain't shit. So, like he said, like I say, look, I give a props on being on some positive shit. But me, I'm with the total opposite shit. But then I can't say the rest of it. I want the world to hear yeah, that. But, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, keep I'm the just bars. saying. Like, I started off, 
Like, but, you know, that's kind of me anyway. I kind of like throwing people off. Everybody was looking like, what is he talking about? But then when mm-hmm. I'm like, oh, this is going to be crazy. Yeah, you grabbed the crowd with that one. You definitely grabbed the crowd with that. Yeah. Um, before we get to the um, fan callers, you want to give your little quick Dome 3 recap? Um, Come on, let's do it. All right, let's see. We got the first battle. We had uh, um, B Magic and Charlie. Oh, Cliff. no, no. You know what? I can't do it. I can't do it. Let's, let me not lie. I can't do it. Because when I battle, I don't watch the battles. Oh, so you wasn't into them? Okay. I feel you. I, I wasn't. You was in- when chilling, I was battling, and I was back there sitting down meditating. You know, so. Well, you, I you, you was nothing. next. You was next. So, yeah. I was well, next. Um, yeah. Did you see any so of the battles I, I afterwards? I see and Hitman because they was after me. I didn't see them. I seen round one of Surf and you know I seen that battle on TV. So mm-hmm. my but my um I feel like that battle could go either way. I, I don't think you could be mad at either one of them. Anybody vote with that battle? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So that's the only battle I can really get an assessment on. Oh okay. And you you didn't see Diz and, and Rex. Nah, nah. I was I was upstairs, but I was kind of you know out of it then, so I couldn't yeah. get my attention. You was half ass listening. But I, I I know Rex wasn't impressive like that, so hmm. Rex would have got smoked that night if he put that up against put them rounds up against me. Now you know what? Let me quit talking about Rex, man. Rex, Rex, that's a cool <laughs> dude, man. Let me quit. You know what I'm saying? Let me quit doing that. It's just a shame he let his boy get hit like that. You know what I'm saying? I don't think Shine has Shine been on Twitter. Who, who Shine? I haven't seen Shine. I don't think. Better. I don't think it's he tweeted. Zone three. Like, I haven't even heard from him. I mean, like. So. You know, I think. I think. I think after the battle, Twitter um, um, canceled his account. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you ready to take some calls, T? Yeah, let's take some calls. <laughs> All right, let's go. Uh, five two five, you there? Five two five. All right, let's go. Uh, five six one, you there? Yo, what's good, man? Three little man on Twitter, what's popping, y'all? What's good, man? What's the deal? Big T, what's good, big homie? What's good with you, bro? Big T, Big T, um, before I get to my battle question to you, being that you're from Chicago, what's your take on your uh-huh. city, like, with, with the craziness going on? I know you live in there. What's your what? take, though? But I, saw, I saw a piece that you did on Black TV, and you were breaking it down a little bit, but being that you're hearing all these murders and, and little kids getting shot, what's really good? Can you ins- give us a little insight on what's popping on this shot time? You know, you know what? It, it's like how I said... Right now, we're getting a publicity kind of for it, but it been like this. You know, like, right. it, it been like this. Right now, it, it, this, this is kind of all I know, really. You know, right. so it, it, it's, just a, it's just a messed up feeling, man. Like, have, have people go with this no lacking. Like, that's, that's, right. that's a true statement. Like, everybody's eyes is wide open, attention. Nobody outside, everybody looking over their shoulders. It's a city. But the OG, the OG can't talk to the young boys, though? Excuse me, what the you OG, say? The OGs can't talk to the young boys and tell them, like, yo, you, you know what I mean? You can't, it's, it's like, it's like the yourself. city of freelancing right now. It's like, you know, like, like what could they say? Like, uh, the young boys ain't respecting nothing. They they right, out right. there doing their thing. They got their own crew. So, you know, the, right. the OG of the young boy is probably 17. You feel yeah, me? Right. This, yeah, this is a whole right other group of things. Like, like, like people is you know they doing they you know they under the gangs of GDs, BDs, white schools, MCs, or whatever. Right. But now niggas is clicking up. We're like, okay, these eight, ten, twelve niggas is my niggas. They not. Right. You know what I'm saying? They will go against the GDs for them, even though he a GD. They will go against them. But for these right. twelve though, you feel me? So it's a lot of more gangs. It's like the gangs is. Spreading out, so it's more violent. It's more violent. Well, Nick T, listen, man. You know, before the battle, okay. before the battle, with you and K Shine, you know, the thing on Twitter, Battle Rap Arena, we all listened to, and the the talk was going into the battle was Shine gonna win live, uh-huh. and you win on camera. Well, we kind of uh-huh. killed that notion. I wasn't at the battle, but from what everybody's saying, and yes, you don't see K Shine on Twitter. 
You know what I'm saying? We can kill that them kind of talks. No, Big T, my nigga. Right. Disrespect, man. We ain't trying to see battle on Jay Mills and Reed Dollars, some niggas that we haven't seen in how long, my nigga? Oh, yeah. You get no you get right. to me. Right, right. You get no points off that. You get no points murking off the yeah. nigga we had battles in oh six. Now I'm gonna throw a name at uh-huh. you. And I just want to get your opinion. I think I threw it at you on Twitter. Mm-hmm. So let's go, my Slave Seven, my nigga. Mm-hmm. I would, so I would love to see you Slave Seven get in. Yep, I would love to see that. Slave so Seven good. Slave so Seven good. He, he, I, I would like somebody to give him a shot, man. though. I like to see somebody give give some a shot. Like niggas be giving all these other niggas shots, and these niggas in y'all league who who. who it's a good look for them. I know you, you probably do him a favor. That's how you feel because you're a bigger name. But I would love to see that, man. You know what I mean? And, and, I think and it's still a nice. I think it's still a nice. I think he's doing Hello? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I, mean, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah I think it's still a nice. I think he's doing his thing. I don't know. He just don't. I don't know, man. Bars, I, I really he got bars on, man. He got bars on. Yo, fam, he, he got, got bars bodies he, he under his got belt. Bars he got bodies his, under, his, just, under his belt. He bodied old red. This is real talk. He bodied Shug. Yeah. He bodied yeah, your man. He, he, well, 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 look, like, you can't say people don't give him a shot. But when he does get his shot, he does lose. Disaster. What happened? Yeah, big team. Everybody, every battle rapper caught an L. Hey, my hold name. on, hold on, hold on. Let's not, let's not go to disaster. Head okay. ice. Who? Head, head ice. Head ice. Oh, all right, all right, all right, head ice, okay. I'll give you head ice. But what happened after that? That's what I'm saying. Like, you know, like, you know I, 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 I feel like, you know what, like, I feel about Sway Silver. I feel like Sway Silver. I don't want to say, I just don't want to say it like he beat bombs or whatever. But it's like, you know. <laughs> And every time you, really ba- you can only, you, you only battle on. the niggas they put in front of you, a big team. You can only battle the niggas they put in front of you, my nigga. Is what that's you true. do. That's true. That's when true. When they put a nigga in front of your girl, what you gonna do? Say something good. Say something good. I'm not gonna count him out. I'm not gonna count. Right, him but, out. but, but, but for some of Madness Three though, for some of Madness Three, even though it's not like you, you BK Shine, we are trying to see you and Rex get it in. I mean, there's no bigger match than some of Madness Three for y'all two to get it in. All the blogs going back and forth. You and Rex to me, right? Dope, man. That's, what that's it is, Rex, like. though. That's Rex's fault. That's Rex being funny. That's him. Sure that's him. Friend. That's not me. I'm here. I'm just well, here. Well, I right? mean, that, that's the like, thing. I'm, well, that, that's Rex's whole argument. Rex said that it's unfair that that you only battle once every six months or once a year. Mm-hmm. That That's Rex's argument mm-hmm. when we argue him. That's his argument. Well, you can say the same thing about Lux, though. Right. You can say the same thing about Lux. I don't think that's... You can say the same thing about Mook. Hello? You can say the same thing about Lux. Lux? You can yeah, yeah, exactly. hold on, hold on. Let, let, let Big T answer for a second, my bad. Right. No, 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 he answered right. You can say the same thing about Mook. You can say the same thing about Lux. Lux battle once every five years. But, hey, when Big T do it, it's a problem. Me and Surf got the same amount of battles. Do, do people think about that? But Surf don't battle once a year, but we got the same amount of battles. But mm. Big T does it. It's a problem. Well, Big That's T, all I'm I was. I feel you. I feel you. We want to see you in the ring. And, and, and real talk, fans out there, and, and Psycho has said this the other day when I hung up the phone a couple of days ago, we put in a lot of pressure on Loaded Lux as a fan base. We're going to be disappointed when that boy gets on that stage and y'all going to expect him to give you a part two that he gave against Calico. And when it doesn't happen, then y'all going to trash Lux. I already see the writing on the wall. Yeah. Oh, y'all sure, man. I know what it is. Mm-hmm. Hip-hop all day, battle rap. That's what it is. All right. Thanks yeah. for the call. We love him, man. All right. Let's, um, I, would, do you agree with that, um, Big T? Because I actually did touch on that. I, I think, like I said, that these fans put Lux on such well, a high pedestal. What do you say? That, 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 was bizarre, that was bizarre, saying Norris Oh, okay. Was I did. <laughs> um, these, these fans put Lux on such a high pedestal that um, it's like when he comes out on his next battle, they, the expectation for him is going to be so high, if he doesn't at least come close to not even matching it, he ain't got, not even passing, just if he doesn't even close to matching it, they're going to kill him. They're going to kill because because the yeah. backlash I heard yeah. on Hollow was crazy, and I didn't think Hollow 
battle was that bad. I just thought that the fans put it right. Like, Hollow was Hollow was Hollow was good. You know, they, they, yeah, they, they kind of wanted. They, so they, that's much. what I think. They wanted the old Hollow. They wanted the same Hollow when he battled me. When Hollow was kind of more of a more funnier and more just straight wordplay. But they don't know Hollow evolved. Hollow spit bars. He he had like crazy setups. You know, but Hollow still came with the awkward, like, 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 like the um, I, um, I, let me battle over here because he about to strike you right now. Like, mm-hmm. that's crazy. That's what Hollow do. Pull out a throw a side hook and then don't nobody see out of nowhere. But it's just that yeah. people probably wanted to see the same thing from him, but he switched it up. You know. Hmm. All right. That's what. Uh, let's go. Um. Let's see. Let's see. Six, seven, eight. You there? Yo, yo, what's good? Yo, what up, Big T? What's the deal? What's the deal? Yo, the, uh, you just say you was over there with Bazaar? Yeah, Bazaar, man. This nigga's high. He's a fag. The dope guy rapper said, "What's up?" Yeah, <laughs> yeah, hey, yeah, hey, yeah. Shout out to that nigga Bazaar, man. But uh, yo, man, uh. uh that's what's up, man. You got that uh, dub on that nigga K. Shine, man. That nigga was on too high on, on the pedestal before you met him. You know what I'm saying? I already knew it was gonna be a problem. What? You know what I'm saying? Right. That trailer already showed me what I need to see. You feel me? I couldn't make it to uh, number three. <laughs> you know what I mean? Nigga had to work and mm-hmm. couldn't make it to number three. That was on my birthday too, so I was really trying to get the see that. But uh, so oh, man, yeah. if I'm being in the building though, man, I hope you get on that stage, bro. I hope I do too. You man. Try, I trying to or what? Too. You trying to or what? BT, be yeah. for real. I'm trying, I'm trying. I'm trying to double back, man. I'm trying to night of main events three, summer man is three days. That shit was crazy, know, man. man. That shit see. was crazy, man. You you, you um you on high in demand right now. You killed Shine, you know what I'm saying? That nigga was on a run, you know what I'm saying? So you know what I mean? He got on stage right. and folded up. You know what I mean? Dot my folded up. Right. You know what I mean? So I mean, niggas want to see you now, dog. Like niggas really want to see you, man. Your stock about to rise for real if you hit that summer man is three and do the same shit or, or better. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. shit, that shit gonna I be crazy, I'm doing dog. better, bro. I'm yeah. planning on doing way better. That was did you up, think man. that bunny line, did you think the bunny ears line was me off, Jesse, God damn, man. I just, I just. <laughs> <laughs> he cut the fuck off. Jesse always cutting it. niggas off, man. God damn, Jesse, I went through, man. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead, Jesse. Go ahead, go ahead, Jesse. You good, man. Go ahead. <laughs> no, I, I, I was going to ask, did you That's think the bunny ears line was going to hit as hard as it did? Um, nah, not really, not really. Kind of, I don't know. I, I, th- I when I when I when I came up with it, it kind of was like it was stupid. I thought it was stupid, but I, I had to keep throwing it around before I perfected it. It, it was like one of those lines I had to meditate on for about four days. Mm-hmm. Before I came up with it, with the perfect way of putting it and everything. Yeah, presenting it. Cause see, like with me, I I get a line, but see that, and and it's also why I take a count. I need to know where my opponent is, cause when I get a line, and I wouldn't just take it and just, cause that's what I think a lot of people do. A lot of these battle dudes, they settle. This is why I beat them at. I write. I beat them in my writing process. You know, this is why I be in that. They get a line. Like, like I see a lot of these proven ground dudes or even the, some of the mainstays dudes. They'll say something, and I'll be like, do y'all know if you just switch one word around, it would have been, like, like crazy? Like, if you would have yeah. just, instead of putting in and putting weird or something like that, it would have, it, mm-hmm. it, it makes it even more better. It makes it grammatically correct all the way around. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. So I really take time in that. Like, if you go through every of my lines, all of them going to make sense, and every word is going to make sense, you know? Like, some people, you uh, say something to fit. Like, let's say Sir, Sir do his, um, like, CSI Miami. I, I, I kind of don't be liking those because CS, you know, it's like he'll make a put. I can't explain it, bro. It's like he'll force a word or something that, it's not the same thing when you say it back. So. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, yeah, I agree. I, I, I think everybody should take extra time, Jesse, to perfect their bars. And their, oh, speaking of which, Big T, did you oh see Jesse last battle? Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> Jesse got a battle? Jesse last battle? Huh? 
Jesse, what are you doing? <laughs> Who you about, it, Jesse? Not. <laughs> All right. Let, um, the caller <laughs> finish this question, or we got next call on the line. <laughs> It was a horrible performance, yo. Earl, Earl choked me up. I, I'm i thinking about never battling. Who you battle, though, Jesse? I, I, <laughs> the thing is, I battled a whack dude. A whack dude, and he beat me. Like, oh. a dude that was actually horrible. <laughs> oh. So, hold on, Jesse. You actually, like, into the battle. Like, like um, I'm battling you for three weeks with preparing. And we're performing and we're battling. You did that. Oh, yeah. I'm going to tweet it to you after the show. I'm going to tweet it to you after the show. You got to oh, see it. Oh, please, bro. Please, bro. <laughs> no, no, no. If you're going to send him anyone, send, send him my Adi Boom battle. That's yeah, I'm, uh, I'm going to send him your last battle. He, he want to go back and dig in and find your Adi Boom battle, he can. But I'm going to send, <laughs> send him the last one. Uh, let's <laughs> take another call. Uh, 206, you there? <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm here. What's up with y'all? <laughs> What's good, sir? I wanted to speak on um, on the thing with Rex. Um, I think I fuck with Rex, but I think that Rex is ducking because um, yeah, Rex was talking about that he would battle Reed Dollars. Reed Dollars ain't battled since I don't even know when. Uh-huh. And I remember him mm-hmm. saying before that he would battle Hollow the Don before Hollow the Don came back. And he called out Jay Mills. Like, these are all niggas that haven't battled in years. So, like, why are you saying that you want to battle Big T? Because he ain't battled in a right. year. Exactly. So, I think, I mean, like I fuck with Rex, but I really don't so think much. Rex want that. He contradicts himself so much, so many interviews. You just go listen to him. Listen to him. He sounds stupid. He say all this, I'm, man, this, 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 man, I ain't battling Big T, but he'll battle... Some dude in Colorado, you know what I'm saying, that we never heard of before. You know, and then he, like you said, he'll battle somebody that ain't battled in six years. Like Reed Dollars, I ain't, man, Reed Dollars ain't battled since he was probably a teenager. But he ready yeah, exactly. to battle Reed Dollars. So, you know, it is just the thing, you know, Rex told me one day, man, like, man, honestly, man, I'm going to keep it real with you. Man, you might be one of the most lyrical dudes in the URL. You know what I'm saying? Or the lyricalist dude, most lyrical dude that you are with him. So he know, he know, he know that he got to come geared up right. You know what I'm saying? But like I said, I don't feel right for how he put Shine out there. And you know what I'm saying? This is a team and this is Dot Mob. Y'all need to have a meeting and sit in a circle and y'all need to talk, work out y'all differences. You know what I'm saying? I ain't like y'all to look like a, y'all to look like a team up there. You know what I'm saying? I ain't like that. You know what I'm saying? I didn't like how Murder Mook was in the balcony while T Rex was sitting all the way in the back, you know, with some dudes in front in front with K Shine that I've never seen before. Only person that looked like he had K Shine back was um Dan Bars. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Dan mm-hmm. Bars, man. You know, Dan Bars don't like me, man. I don't know, man. If you you don't you know when somebody don't like you, you just know it. Like that nigga don't like me. But shout out to Dan Bars anyway. <laughs> but yeah, it's um Gee, it's crazy, bro. They they didn't look like a team. I didn't like I didn't like the way they was looking up there, man. They wasn't cheering K Shine on. He was kind of by himself. I'm like, what are y'all doing? Like the, the crowd started booing K Shine. I'm calming the crowd down. Who done that? Like who done that? Like like nah, y'all let them rap. And this ain't even my city. I started thinking like this ain't even Chicago. What is what am I doing? Yeah. Yeah, he, yeah, he, the crowd was ruthless that day. <laughs> right, <laughs> it exactly. was ruthless. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm not, I'm not a dude. I don't like try to rub it in. You know what I'm saying? Because people might come out, the battle might come out, people might say shine 3-0. You know what I'm saying? Pe- people just like who they like. Like, this game yeah. is crazy, bro. This, this battle game, people like who they like. And don't change their opinion. If you get, if, if, if somebody they love, like somebody like Surf, like like it, the dudes that I used to go back and forth with, the, the surf fan, you can tell him that surf lost to me. You feel me? Mm-hmm. Because he liked surf. Surf gave him enough reason to make it. Well, did you hear that? Did you hear that? Did you hear that? Man, surf won. You know, 
You know, so that this how yeah. the game is. So, you know, it ain't too many unbiased people, you know? So it's cool. It's cool. People like who they like. Yeah. But I didn't like the way Dot Mob looked out there. You know? <laughs> I didn't like it. They need to have a meeting. You know what I'm saying? I'll call a meeting. <laughs> I, I think I think Dan Barr's I think Dan Barr's whole issue was um he said that because Rex shouted you out during the DNA battle and now you guys are going back and forth. I know what he said. I, he said Rex shouted me out because of the DNA battle. Me and Rex all oh, it, it started off battling on just some battle stuff. You know that that whole thing with him and DNA was like he's saying that with DNA said something about being shot so. That's the he got he got him back for me, which you know I I guess that's kind of I don't know man I don't know how to take that I don't know how he got him back for me because I beat DNA, you know so I don't know how he got him back for me but I kind of see what he's saying it's a real angle or whatever like that but as far as me and Rex at first me and him never had no I wasn't ever upset about him like I said me and Rex was supposed to battle. I never even thought about battling Rex. Beasley brought the idea to me. We supposed to battle with DC, but now mm-hmm. all of a sudden, he don't do this. He don't do that. He got on blogs and start. What's the deal, fool? He got on blogs and start going off at the mouth. You feel me? So now I'm going back off at him. You know, it was never no disrespect mm-hmm. thing, but Dan Bar felt it was disrespect. But you know, shout out to Dan Bar, man. I, I'm in town with I said. Mm-hmm. All right. Let's see. Let's try to take another call. Let's go. 812, you there? Yo, what up? Yo, what's good? What up? What up? Where you from? Where you from, bro? South Central Indiana, bro. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, because yeah. these area codes, I'll be like, I'm trying to hear where niggas from. You feel me? Mm. Right, right. Yeah, I'll check you out against uh, Charlie Clips. You did your thing. Uh-huh. And I was in Detroit you, too, but you know what I mean. Obviously, I didn't get to see your battle because I was like three days. Oh yeah, yeah, that, it was a little mishap that happened, mm-hmm. man. But it, you right, know, it worked right. out. Right, right. But yeah, man, I I think you won the best. You know what I'm saying? Lyrically, like uh, T Rex said, lyrically, you're killing it. You know what I mean? The way you put your shit together and like Thank you, you know, like Sue Surf, the way he did the CSI shit. I be saying the same thing. Shit don't be making sense and shit like. Uh huh. You gotta put the shit together, right? You know, I pr- I agree with yeah. you. Yeah. Uh, I uh-huh. like to see you. I like to see you versus like maybe a Tay Rock or like an Ill Will, cause all of y'all's lines is just action packed, and I think those would be uh-huh. better. But I know, you know, what I mean, Ill Will's an up and comer. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I think you and yeah. Tay Rock, as long as you don't be coming with the light bars. He come with some serious uh-huh. shit. I think y'all could put on the class, yeah. man. Yeah. Yeah. Tay Rock dope. I like Tay Rock. Tay Rock dope. I always thought Tay Rock was dope. You know what I'm yeah. saying? I always thought Tay Rock was dope. You know, Ill Will right now. Yeah, and nah, I smoke Ill Will. It ain't it ain't cause of Ill Will not nice. It's cause he doesn't have the experience yet. Right. You know, he's good. He's like he <laughs> like the prospects. He like the um like damn I. Big T, if this guy get a couple good, get good, um, a couple more, a year or so, he might jump in the ring with you. But right now at this level, me being seasoned, him kind of, you know, getting there, he won't be right. do nothing with me. Right, right. And uh, one more question. I mean, I noticed in the Tay Rock B Magic battle, he wasn't claiming dot mob like that. It was a strictly K game. Did y'all notice that? Or is Tay Rock no longer mm. affiliated. I, that ain't a question for you, Big Team, but just Battle Rap Arena. Yeah, I don't, know. I don't know. I don't know. You yeah, know, you know, you know it's easy it. to join Dot Mob and leave Dot Mob. You know, I, matter of fact, I'm I'm in Dot Mob. I'm Dot Mob. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Dot Mob. For real, for real. Somebody from now on, I'm Dot Mob. And can't nobody tell me I ain't because it's easy to join it. That's how, you see? Is that easy? I'm Dot Mob. <laughs> Hey, one more right, question. So one it, more question. It's, it's official Big T's Dot Mob on Battle Rap Arena yes. show. Big T's right. uh, Dot Mob. I've seen, I've seen an event in Chicago coming up. Uh, is Big mm-hmm. Cannon battling twice? Yeah, Big Cannon out there doing his thing, man. Everybody come to the event. It's this Saturday. Support, you know, 
with Gracie, Big Cannon. It's going to be a Chicago event, and plus it's a lot of new talent coming up. So let's 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 do it. Everybody come up, come out this weekend. I think it's at the Rap Factory. If y'all don't know where it's at, if y'all are trying out, trying to um, join the game and the battle game, you know, in Chicago around that area, you know, Jesse Reekin gonna come try out. Yeah. <laughs> Get his ass whooped up. 40 ounce chest. 40 ounce chest is the battle rap name. 40 ounce chest. Yes. <laughs> All right. Thanks but for the yeah, call. Yeah. Big Cannon battling it twice. I think he battled against my boy, Junie J. And I don't know who else he battled, but my um, my boy, he battled my boy, Junie J. So hold on. He battled twice the same night? Same night. Big Cannon is crazy. He's a monster. Oh, my God. That's crazy. Props to him for even uh-huh. thinking about doing something like that. Shout three out. round I ain't, nobody, I ain't seen nobody. I, two, I guess they three round battles. I ain't seen nobody try that since the Immaculate, and we know what happened after that. Immaculate ain't been the same. He tried, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah that was about a difference when the Immaculate did it, it the same night. Huh? What was wrong with him? I, I was about to say there was a difference when Immaculate did it. He took, he took him on... Two of the biggest names. I mean, yes, that's what I'm saying. He did not. Nah, it was crazy. These guys went. All right, Hollow the Don was cool. That these guys went. Kissita was a nobody. Yeah, that's why he did it. He Kissita wasn't popping like that when Immaculate battled him. But boy, I ain't heard that many Mac rounds. Oh, that's a good line. I ain't heard that many Mac rounds since. He, but anyway, yeah. <laughs> that, yeah, but yeah, that the um, that I it didn't turn out too good, but Big Ken about to pull it off. If he pulls this off, he he got nothing but respect for me. I already fucked with him anyway, but like this would be oh, yeah. this would be crazy <laughs> if he gets this off. Mm-hmm. Let's mm-hmm. let's go. Um, let's see, eight six zero. You there? Yo. Yeah. Yo, Yo this Connecticut, big- right? It's Connecticut. Yo, Connecticut, right? Yes, sir. What's going on, brother? What's the deal? All right. Yo, um, you ain't think you want to get it on with Lux? You're not trying to get Lux? I would love to battle Lux. I think you're the, I think you're the most worthy him. opponent for him at this point. You know what I'm saying? Especially yeah. after the Norm yeah, 3 yeah. thing. I think that, I think you proved to be a little more, um, like, um, more of a candidate for him to hollow. Mhm. You know, you know, a lot of people, a lot of people, these people. Nah, nah, nah. I, I appreciate, I appreciate him. I feel like I would be. I think it'll be a good battle too. I think Hollow, Hollow will be a good battle with Lux too. That's my boy. So you know, don't, don't. Uh, he, he, one of those dudes I battle him. You can't count him out the hat, especially. Especially after people was doubting them right now, because remember, Hollow was was beating people in their cities. Hollow just started battling back in New York, so when when he he reacted good under pressure. So oh, now I know that everybody yeah. is kind of, you know, now people kind of at him. So ain't no telling what he'll do. Don't put no dog against the corner. But oh, like I said, I, I think, with me and Lux, I think it'll be crazy. I think it'll be I crazy. Think Hollow, I think Hollow. I think Hollow. Um, I think he beat Surf. I got him being Surf two to one. So, um, uh huh, yeah. I got I got yeah. Hollow beating Surf two to one. So I already yeah, know Hollow's yeah, a piece. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I just think like the way the, when you threw that shot in the first round, not a shot, but you know what I'm saying? When you uh-huh. when you threw that out there, it kind of made sense to me. Like when I was watching, I was uh-huh. like, yo, I think that would be. I think uh-huh. that I started picturing it like that. As soon as you said that, I'm like, oh shit! And I'm looking at you on stage, yeah. and I'm like, but you, I just think it would, it would be exciting. I think at this point, I don't think you need to battle anybody, but like a legend, you know what I'm saying? I don't think it, yeah, it, it that's, makes that's, sense for you to be going in that way. That's how I feel, man. Like, like I appreciate that. Like, Lux, I think Lux, Lux dope, but like I say, I watch him. I feel like it was, um, I feel like he could be beat. I don't feel like he's unbeatable. But, and I feel like I, I bring something to the stage that he ain't ready for. Like, he gonna, t- like, he gonna taste his own blood. Lead that. It's gonna be a war. It's gonna be a war. Any way you put it, and Big T is not do, getting clouded by no loaded looks. Do you I have rounds ready? No, I don't got rounds ready for. 
No, I'm not rounds ready for nobody. I don't. I, I can't write a round for nobody. I don't know I'm battling. It's very hard yeah. to do. Mm-hmm. Like even like even if people start throwing rounds, what's the deal, bro? They start throwing rounds of people in my that day, and then I start thinking about them like brainstorming. But I like like people say like the T you've been um sitting for on the year of rhymes, but at the same time, like I probably have a general bar here, two or three in the battle, but I don't write until I have an opponent. I don't write battles until I have an opponent. And then like I say, like how how like I just don't be battling. I like I be on my knees like how you say, Man, you put a what's the name out every week. You know what I'm saying? You put out you put out a big T Tuesday joint every week. I you know, I, I kinda switch it up. I kinda do both. So when people think that I'm rusty, I'm still writing rhymes. I'm still getting better as far as thinking with with the pen. I'm just not focused in my battling mode. So when it's time to battle, I'm still sharp like I was when I just did it last year. Yeah. That's that's what's up. Let's uh let's see, I know we got a Milwaukee caller here. Uh four one four, you there? Oh, yeah, no doubt. Big stacks on the deck. What to do? What's good, man? What's the uh, deal? Uh, man, Big T know I mess with them. You know, every time they have an event in Chicago, I'm there. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, man, when is Prince Lord going to come back? Man, tell that man to battle more, dog. Oh, uh, my boy Prince Lord. You know what's crazy, man? If it's always something with the footage with my boy Prince Lord, man. You know, Prince Lord just had rest in peace with one when his sisters passed or whatever. So, you know, he 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 bounced him back from that, you know. But he he doing his thing, man. We we trying to see him more. What's the thing? I'm trying to get him on that PG card. I wish Norms was online so I could negotiate that. See what Lord Lord mm-hmm. do against one of these PG dudes. Cause that was my sparring partner. You know, I'm saying he hey, real me around up in high school. Yeah, real talk. Going back to last year at Gnome too, I think Prince Lord had the coldest round in Chicago. The first round against Zeus, that was that shit. Like he spit a yeah. a real nigga's dream in that first round. You know what I mean? And nobody exactly. got to see that shit. Yeah, yeah, and and that's one thing he do that 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 that, that the game kind of like the edginess, like you know that's what Lord will bring to the to the table, like where you can fill this nigga rhymes, you know what I'm saying? Cause you mm-hmm. know we got a story to tell, you know what I'm saying? I don't know how everybody else's life is, but like people starting to see it, like with Chicago, like it's really, <laughs> it's really a, it's really going on. This is not. I mean, when you no fairy tale. when you can spit a rhyme and and when you make the person feel the emotion that, you know, what you're spitting about, that's what makes you special. I believe Lord could be special. You feel what I'm saying? I mean, mm-hmm. you, of course, know mm-hmm. you're my number one cat, like real talk. But um, you already know. <clears throat> my whole thing is this. It's a lot of fraudulent, fake-ass shit that's going on in the game right now. You know what I mean? And like I said, it's, it's, mm-hmm. it's missing out on real folks. But uh, a lot of folks have already right. touched upon, you know, the topics that I want to call on, which was one, you battling once a year, which is, hey, if you hit, if you catch the heat, Lux got to catch the heat, too. Um, mm-hmm. I think he'll dog walk Rex, you know. Jesse will be looking mm-hmm. with the sad face. I'm going to have to cheer him up and buy him an extra 40. Same old so, Rex. But, uh, yeah, man, I, w- I would like to see you and Lux go at it, though, for real. Mm-hmm. That'll be, that'll be a lovely fight. Yeah, real tough. You know what I'm saying? Next event, I won't make this Saturday. I'll be in St. Louis next week, though. But uh, the next event in Chicago, I will be seeing you, dog, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Be cool. Stay up. Yes, sir. Man, keep dropping that good music. Yes, sir. All right. I, I mean, don't yes, don't get it twisted, yo. T is beating anybody. But if he, if he goes against Rex, me and Psycho were having this argument before we even had T on the phone. If he's going against Rex, he's not going to win that one. <laughs> oh yeah, that's cool. Hey, you know what I'm thinking about? All right, let's let's go with my honest opinion about Rex. Rex is dope. Rex is I can't I can't say Rex is the most strong lyrically, but Rex is probably one of the all around best battlers. Period mm-hmm. in the game. Like he's a pure like like I I gotta say with Hollow Hollow and Rex they pure battlers. Like they like yeah. they like you could be punching the shit out of them. But what they do 
would damn near beat beat a nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like I can't explain. Like Young Ill, I I I, I still say Young Ill got this. You know what I'm saying? It's my boy, whatever. But Young Ill was just throwing so many haymakers at Rex. But when Rex was doing his thing, it wasn't like Rex was throwing haymakers back. But you better pour it in or pour it out. You know, he was just all around everywhere, and he was able to keep up, or if not, some people say he beat him. So, mm-hmm. you know, so you know, I, I, I give him, he's good like that. So he's an all-around battler. I, you know, I, I prefer battling all-around dudes, you know. I prefer being in fights. I don't like not being in fights. Yeah. I'll tell you. Let's, let's and you know, like, so, uh, between, between the old cats, like, between the old cats, I feel at the time, because me and Rex been going kind of at it since Summer Madness 2. His performance he put on Summer Madness 2 was like, okay, damn, this the guy kind of, all right, that's who I want to be. That's that, the Rex that's you put out of the, That's the, I want to, I felt like he was the best out of the bunch that night. I liked his performance mm. better than Lux that night. So we ain't really probably didn't transfer mm. on camera like that, but. Rex looked at the most impressive to me that day. Yeah. He was yeah, rebuttaling. Rex. He was acting it out. Only thing I didn't like was how he was dick sucking from the, um, you know what I'm saying? He wanted Diddy to, you know, throw his drink on him and shit from the, from the balcony. <laughs> That's the only thing I ain't like. You know what I'm saying? He wanted, he opened his mouth, told Diddy to put a rock in his mouth from the balcony and shit. You know what um. what I'm saying? I, I ain't like that. That's the only part I didn't like. <laughs> but other than that, he was excellent. He was excellent. Other than that, he was excellent. Yeah, his second round was crazy that night. Yeah, he was, he was doing his thing, man. So, so like, like all these dudes, all these dudes that I'm picking with is is no slouches. They not no slouches. Yeah. They ain't like I'm just. So, it ain't, so it ain't some like man I'm the like street, you're, you're really looking on. for Rex on that stage, right? Some man in the street, you versus huh? Rex. That's what you want. Some man in the street, you some versus man. Rex, right? <sighs> And it don't have to be Summer Madness 3. You know, it, it could be, for some reason, I don't feel it's going to be Summer Madness 3, just to keep it real. It's not happening. I, I don't think it's happening. But, you know, it'll be, it'll, it's like battling us, Dot Mob Dude, right back to back. It's kind of like, you know, it's kind of boring. Mm-hmm. But, yeah. Yeah. But me and Rex is the, what, what, how many more battles is in demand? other than me versus T-Rex, y'all. Think about it. Who, what are the battles is like having build-ups like, damn, I got to see that. Lux and Hollow, yeah. and what else? Yeah, y'all, yeah. I mean, over this last year, y'all went back and forth blogging and tweeting and everything else, and even on this, even on this show, the, going back and it, forth it, for like it, a it's year. It's only meant to be. It's, it's almost like it's meant to be to happen on what, what WrestleMania. It's, it's like, you know what I'm saying? Mhm. Yeah, I feel exactly what you said. Like it's like y'all promoted the fuck out the battle without it even being official. Like so, like it only makes sense for it to happen. Mhm. Let's see. Uh, I think it's St. Louis. Let's go out uh, to three one three. Is that St. Louis? Yeah. Three one three. That's Detroit. Three one three. Detroit. My bad. Okay, Detroit. What's good? Yeah, my I'm on. Yeah, what's good? Yo, big, yo, what's up, big T? What's what? the deal? Shit, yo. Man. Yo. Man, what big up? T. Yeah, we are. I think you top five. No bullshit. And I think you need to stop playing. Get off your ass. You're not going to kill you, so you can earn your spot. Because they, they ain't trying to give you no respect. They ain't trying to give you no respect out here. They not. They not. They not, bro. You, you, they not. Got, they not. I'm going to I'm gonna have to keep killing innocent people. I'm going to start these, with shine. Oh, <laughs> <You got, laughs> bro. But you yeah. Got these Thank you, bro. You got these niggas thinking B-Magic better than you. I mean, B-Magic the next nigga up behind you, but other than that, you got to start killing these niggas. So even if they throw a dead horse at you, just kill them so you can earn your spot. It don't matter. It ain't even got to be no big name. Just start killing these niggas so... So that so that name you want can be like, oh, BC out here putting in that work. So I gotta take them out. So what you telling me is innocent people gotta die. Innocent people gotta die, Tish. Yeah, innocent come on, people man. just kill them. Okay, you right, you right. You ain't never lie. If 
people keep I, playing, innocent people gonna have to die. And I and I think you should take out Sway first. When you take out Sway, then everybody gonna be like, oh, somebody Sway got to be the innocent guy that gotta do. Sway got to be the innocent guy that gotta die. Sway on his high horse. He got all these body bags under his belt, and he think everybody running from him. So you man up and bag his ass. Then what everybody gonna say after that? Right, exactly. Mm-hmm. I, I personally think you and Sway would be a good battle, like just as far as like you know, uh, as far as like a classic matchup. I think it would be a good battle. I know it's probably not a name that you're big about getting in the ring with, but yeah. just talking a classic it's, battle, it's, it's I think y'all fight. can put it's one. A good fight. It's a yeah. good fight. Me and Sway would be a good fight. I, I'm not gonna take nothing against him, but it's me and Sway would be a good fight. It's, it's probably not the you know. It's probably not the ticket seller that, you know, mm. at the end of the day, that's what, that's what this game is about, about selling mm. tickets. But, it, it, you know, I, I'm not, I'm not going to lie. It's me and Sway would be an excellent fight. Yeah, I, I agree. I agree. I, I'd like to see it happen one day. It ain't got to be soon, mm-hmm. but one day I would like to see y'all two get in the ring together. Maybe on a they, maybe maybe in you know a, a odd odd like a July or October some weird shit like that you know yeah maybe at a SOBs event you never battled the SOBs yet have you nah nah I was supposed to battle DNA there I think the first time oh okay yeah let's go uh, let's go four two four you there where's this at maybe SOBs event you never battled the SOBs yet have you four two four Nah, nah, I was going to go with DNA, yeah. They listening. They listening. Yeah. Let's go uh, 216, you there? What up, what up? What up, 40? What up, what up? What up? What up? All right, what's the deal? Hello? Yeah, we are you. Yo. Yo, Big T, what, what, whatever happened to that, uh, that match out with uh, Nikki Fax? Um, whatever happened to Maxwell Mickey Fax? I don't yeah. know, man. Look, we supposed to battle. Let me put it like this. One second, I'm in this hotel lobby. We were supposed to battle in, um, and Mickey's supposed to battle in South by Southwest, right? So, right. for some reason, that didn't go down. It didn't go down. I guess the bread wasn't right. I, I think Mickey probably was asking for too much then, maybe. I don't know. Something happened where it didn't go down. So, I was like, okay. As soon as didn't go down to South by Southwest, I kind of went interested because I wanted to beat Mickey in front of the blog sites that love him and be boycotting my videos and all that shit. So I wanted to smoke him in front of them. So that was my kind of method to my madness over there. Now, if we were going to do what they said, do it some of Madness 3. Okay, boom, some of Madness 3 come around. He rapped his verse on Battle Rap Arena. Okay, let me ask you a question. Okay, well, let me ask you a question. <clears throat> What did you feel about these uh, verses? Like I said, I said it earlier. Um, I felt his verses was good. I felt his verses was kind of it was good, bro. But it was kind of amateurish at the same time. So, so you saying it was? So, are you saying it wasn't ready for the URL I platform? I wasn't scared of it. I wasn't worried. I wasn't worried about it. Okay. Now look, the last caller. He said two things that, that it makes sense. These these matchups make sense for you. Uh, P Magic, one because well, one because a lot of people from the URL feel, he feels like he's the one to beat in the Midwest. And Sway Sever, yeah, because he's like the underdog, and seems like everybody wants to give him a a, a, <laughs> a fair shot, a chance. You know what I mean? They have the sympathy for this uh-huh. man, so I want to see him. Actually, okay, this is what you want. This is what you're asking for. Don't spank that ass. You know what I mean? Spank sway itself ass so uh-huh. people can shut up about this dude because I don't see it. But please, just spank his ass. You know what I yeah, mean? Give him a shot. Either him or be magic because these people on URL always say that uh, be magic is the one to beat in the Midwest. You know what I mean? I think he's top right now. So let's uh-huh. prove it. Who is the best in the Midwest? You or be magic? <laughs> All right, don't, don't even give me the answer to that. But yeah, man, I, I think both of them. I think both of them are nice, you know. They like, make I, sense. I, I, think Those cold. Make sense. I, I like the magic shit. 
Yeah, yeah, that, yo, you know what, T, that kind of brings me to my next question, though. It's kind of like, yo, why do you think you don't get as much credibility? Because, like, you're one of the best on your world. Because I don't, because I don't, because I don't, because I, I don't go over, I don't probably, my, my tweet, I don't be tweeting all day. And, you know, when people like who they like, they, they probably like Surf Cuss, the way he act or, you know what I'm saying? Maybe, I don't know, shit. You know, because I'll that, be that's what I'm saying. Do you, back you feel maybe, do you feel maybe you should? Sometimes do you... Like, maybe I should. Maybe I should. I, I don't say, about, you're, you're damn near un, to me, you're damn near unbeatable. Like, I really can't think of nobody that, that that has a chance with you in the ring. But you don't Thanks. get the recognition you deserve. I mean, is it because... Yeah, because... People like they champ, man. People like paper champions. They like um. They 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 rather they they like slogans more than bars. You know what I'm saying? So they rather have some the, the, the people tweet with them all day. You know, so they like them as far as that. He, they might be following them. You know, and I probably don't follow. You know, it, it's a lot of reasons why people like who they like. I'm not gonna go there or why they don't like me. They probably don't like me because I'm big. You know what I'm saying? If, if people don't understand. There's people out here like this. There's people that just don't probably like Big T because Big T is a big dude. You feel me? Like, okay, uh, I don't like him. You know, that, that's how it is. The game fucked up like that. But, you know, I could do better. I, I could tweet more. You know, that's that's kind of, that's, that's one thing that I could do. Mm-hmm. Hello? Yeah. Yeah, we, yeah, yeah, we here. Oh, okay. Yeah, right. let's uh, let's go to another call. Let's go eight four five. You there? Yeah. Where's this at? Yeah, where you where you calling from? Eight four five. Oh, this is upstate. Yeah. What up, Jess, okay. man? What up, Psycho? What up, Big T, man? What's man. good? What's I'm good? glad you plugged me in right after that, nigga, man. Cause I word, I got some. Sh- All right, the, the thing. It's not that you're not getting the respect, right? Cause I'm one of those niggas that pick shine to beat you, to shine on that run and all of that, right? Mm-hmm. We got the Clips battle mm-hmm. with you. The Clips battle is that faulty auto, so that's the shit we still waiting on the QP John John shit, correct? That's the same event? Mm-hmm. Exactly. Yeah, see? So so and that, that was crazy. The audio with that helped Clips a lot too, bro. That's and and see, yeah, that helped yeah, yeah see, it might have. Well, it might have because if you didn't go, then shit, you don't know. You know what I mean? On audio, like you said, if you fucking with clips and you rocking into that, you like, oh, well, I ain't hear it all, but it must have been not. Like, you listening to K-Shine and John John shit, some of this shit you can't even hear. After he said pom-poms, he just screaming with the crowd going so loud, you don't even hear the punchline. Then niggas get louder, like, but we don't know what the fuck you said mm-hmm. on camera, you know what I'm saying? So that... You take the work. That, you know what I mean? That takes away a little bit of it. Then your next shit was Sue Surf. You know what I'm saying? That wasn't on the big stage. So niggas, oh, well, it's a small room. Well, the small room, you're going to kick ass in the small room because you're, you're lyrical, like niggas say. And niggas won't get so bored waiting for you to punch. You know what I mean? Because your punches is drawn mm-hmm. out on stage. It's like, well, who, niggas was concerned. That she was gonna take too long, you feel me? And then they was gonna bully you. Like they mm-hmm. tried to for a little bit. I wasn't even in the room, you know what I'm saying? And and nigga said you three o them or possible two one, depending on I mean one of the rounds. But well, I think that's where it is, and that's where everybody was running. Like, yeah, Keshawn gonna kill him. But then there was still that crowd. Like, wait, nah, y'all don't y'all don't know about Big T? Like he, he stepped this shit up. Right. So cuts like you. And like hold you on, say, hold on. That's another thing. Too, on, bro. One thing that, and for me, not battling so much. Because, look, yes. the URL fan base is growing. So, like, if I sit out a year, it would be a year worth of new people that don't know who I am. Like, because cause it, it happened, I noticed that. Like, okay, because I, when I sat out my first year was DNA to surf. I think I, I, I sat out after DNA, and I battled again to sue surf, I think. But mm-hmm. Sue Surf accumulated all of these fans. And, yes. you know, then, you know it, the game got bigger. And then now I come out of nowhere. they like, who is he? I'm like, who am I? I'm the first battle on you on the Hold on. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So yeah. now I got you know, to beat a nigga. Now I step out another <clears> year. Now I come back. It's Charlie Cook. Who is this nigga? Who am I? Then I got to go beat another. You feel me? So yeah, that, that, yeah. that, that's. that's Kinda, I see then, why people like you know, 
Cause, cause, he, cause they're like they'll come doubting me. Like, damn, I seen him. You know, this game is about what you prove. Okay, I seen him, but what can he do? You know, exactly. I knew what I could do in a exactly. big crowd. I knew what I knew what I could do in a big crowd. You know, cause as far as how I know my mind work, cause big crowd, little crowd, I don't see no crowd. <laughs> kind of mm-hmm. up when I say that, but like I don't. It's it's the, it's the same as two people in the room as a thousand people in the room. Damn yeah. When I when I battle, so that's how I go about it. But people can't go like, okay, yeah, we seen him shine in the big crowd. We seen what he could do. So well, of that, course that's one of the statements that were made though, with you versus Sir. Right. Yeah. Do you think the battle would have mm-hmm. went the same way if it if it would have happened in the Detroit crowd? Yes, probably even worse. Yes, because I had a I had a lot more things that. <clears throat> That I was saying that I knew crowd participation would have went crazy. You know what I'm saying? So I was kind of shaky about one of my rounds because I'm like, damn, the crowd ain't in here. So, but it still turned out to be good. But yeah, any, anyway, it don't matter. It doesn't matter. The crowd doesn't matter to me. I see. I see. I, I I won't doubt you in the big room no more. Let's just put it like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. My boy Calico was like, Big T, you was all over the stage. I was like, I, I, I see you like that. I didn't even notice. As far as I'm concerned, I was standing in one spot. <laughs> but the, the, my boy yeah. Calico said I was all over walking in niggas' faces and turning around and flexing at the crowd, like doing all type of weird shit. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to see that battle on footage. Let's see. Uh, let's go. I hope, Three I more points. I hope it looks as good as people say, man. Cause you know, like, I, like I'm a, like I'm a professional. Like I've been in this shit, so I know how shit could not look as good in real life it's on cameras it did in real life. So I just, yeah, I just pray that shit come out right. Yeah, I, I believe it will. I, I know you. I know you're your own hardest critic, and so I know you're right. gonna like be extra hard on it. But yeah, I think it's gonna come out looking all right, though. That's uh. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Three one four, you there? Hello. Yeah, what's good? Yo, what's good? What's good, Big T? What up, Psycho? What's going on, man? What's good? What's hey, good? STL, St. Louis. What's good? Hey, nothing. What's poppin', man? Um, yeah. Um, shout out to you, Big T, for putting on for the Midwest and everything like that. But um, just wanted to comment on what on the last caller was saying. Um, I don't know. I don't think it's like a matter of you not getting respect. Honestly, because, well, I don't know, because I know cats from, like, a lot of places, like, East Coast niggas, you know, West Coast niggas, and all of them say the same about you, local, and you nice. You know what I'm saying? I just mm-hmm. think, like, with the new URL fans, you know what I'm saying? Cause I'm an old head. I'm, like, 29 right now. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just trying to, right. I watched your first battle when it first, first came. And I'm talking about one of the first hundred views. I'm talking about with you and Deacon Rose. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it's like there's a lot of new new URL fans that just like they flaky, you know what I'm saying? So they see like Yeah. Like 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 you ain't battling a minute, so there's a lot of shit going on, like they like getting butt ass naked on stage and then you got J C taking like right. four or five six battles and shit <laughs> like that. You know what I'm saying? So the attention is just going elsewhere. You know what I'm saying? Instead of right. sitting back and like with the older fans doing like sitting back and just watching the battle and debating it, you know what I'm saying? And shit like that. You got a lot of fans that mm-hmm. just like no matter what you do, you can come on stage, you can spit the best three rounds of your life. If this nigga come and do like a spit like a verse that's a five out of ten because he's liked by a lot of people, they gonna say, Ah, oh, it was debatable. Oh, exactly. It was debatable. And all exactly. that. Like it's like lie. doing surf battle, like I don't like I, I think surf is a top ten. You know what I'm saying? But I'm like one one of those non biased people that watch this shit. Like I honestly don't see how a nigga can give it to Surf. Surf wasn't whack, though. You know what I'm saying? He right, wasn't right. whack or nothing like that. But it's like, like, come on. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, exactly. if a nigga win, a nigga win. That's not saying a nigga whack. You know what I'm saying? I'd rather see two cats get in, put it, put on a, a good battle. But you know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, one of them got to win. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. And as far as, like, T-Rex, I don't know. I don't want to see. I don't know. I, I just don't want to see that battle, to be honest with you. I don't think that... Mm-hmm. They already know what's gonna happen. It's like you gonna like you gonna um, you gonna spit some shit to him. You gonna be lyrical. He gonna come back and he's not gonna be as lyrical. And he's just gonna put on the performance and then Cassie gonna call it debatable. 
You know what I'm saying? I'd rather see mm-hmm. you spit with like a heavy hitter, somebody that's gonna come back and spit some some lyrical shit. And I like the, I put you up there in the top ten because of the shit that you write. You see mm-hmm. what I'm saying? And they're like lyricists. You know what I'm saying? And I heard somebody mm-hmm. say this one time, like they called you like a lyrical scientist. And that shit was mm-hmm. so cool. The that shit that you spit against um in that hollow with the with the um, the silencer in the middle of the round, you just you know what I'm saying? That's probably shit I'm hearing. Um, I wasn't there for the for the, the K Sean battle, but it pretty much went the way that I thought it was gonna be. I can't wait for that shit to drop. And um uh-huh. I actually wanna see you versus J Mills. I think J Mills is Yeah, because I think J Mills is from like the old era where you had to spit. You know what I'm saying? You had to come on the block and you had to right. spit. You know what I'm saying? I, I want to see some shit where somebody's going to throw some lyrics at you. I, I mean, I mean that, don't get me wrong. I'm not saying Jim Mills going to come out of nowhere and do some shit, but that battle got me more intrigued that, than, than what's the name? Um, what's his name? What's that nigga's name? Um, Reed Dollars or some shit? No, I don't want to see that shit. Right. Right. At all. But shit, yeah, shout yeah, out to y'all, yeah, yeah. man. I'm not trying to take out too much of your time. Oh, yeah. Um... Got to give you a shout out for putting on the shot, making a lot of noise with a lot of cats that I know from like outside of St. Louis, like crazy. You know what I'm saying? So keep that shit up for real. Real talk. Shout out to Battle Rap Arena, though. All right. That's yes, what's up. Sir. Thanks for the call. No doubt. Yo, what? Well, well, Cyber goes to the next caller, man. He he mentioned something, Big T. I mean, what do you think about daylight antics? It is is it is daylight. What it is, daylight or? is funny, man. I, I, I'm kind of, uh, you know, of course I'm not cool with a man just getting butt ass naked. Of course, it's not, it's not cool. But he's funny, bro. You know what I'm saying? Maybe, like, like, like I, I see where he's going. He, he, he damn near. He, what's crazy is people are saying daylight antics is, is 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 wild, but daylight got bars, bro. He's rapping. Yeah. Yeah, he's but just I, not thing listen, though, do you think he's just not acting like all the bars are. I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I can't say it. It, 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 it's, it's cool. It, it, the game, it's, it's a breath of fresh air. Keep the game going. You know I don't think he's killing the game. Like I was just hearing him in <coughs> Tech 9. I damn near threw up laughing. It, it, it was hilarious. <laughs> One of the best battle rap winning shows I've ever heard in my life. But, you <laughs> yeah, know, they both, was, they both was making valid points. You know what I'm saying? They both said they hurt the game, but they both helped the game, if they asked me. They both helping it. You know, I'm not with the man getting butt ass naked or all, or all that. But you know, it's it's, it's kind of funny. You know, the man had a full fledged Batman suit on, bro. Come on, I still man. Still got to see what that. What is wrong with the I'm, guy? I'm gonna watch that tonight. A full fledged Batman suit, in, and it was crazy. It don't look like a cheap little Batman suit. It looked like this nigga actually got it tailored to fit him. <laughs> <laughs> Like some movie motherfuckers made it for him or something? Yes, like he really got a tailored ass back being fit. <laughs> Yo, that motherfucker's a retard. <laughs> uh, let's see, let's try uh, six, six what nine, you there? Yeah, 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 what's up with it? What's good, man? What's the deal? Like, what's up? Where's Jesse at? He right there, drinking. <laughs> yeah, I'm here. What's up? 40. What's up? Hey, this I, I, I rock. 619. What's up? I'm talking about uh, Big Kitty ducking well, Rex. Nigga, you, you ducking me. What's up with that battle? Oh, uh, shit. Oh, that I'm ducking I keep, you? I keep hitting you on Twitter, <laughs> nigga. What's up with it? This I rock. Man, what's happening? Oh, what up, man? Um, I, what's up? I don't know. I mean, did you see my last yeah. battle? I don't, I don't know if I'm going to battle for a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Thinking, well, I mean, I mean, everybody else killing you because I wanted to get mocked, you know what I'm saying? I wanted some of the action, my nigga. All right, we'll yeah. see what's up. I mean, you got a, I, yeah. right now you got a question for Big T. This yeah, is not my yeah, show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is Big yeah. T's show. Big T is the show. <laughs> the guest of the hour. You got yeah, a question whatever, for Big nigga. T. Whatever, nigga. Big T, what's happening <laughs> with it, girl? What's the deal, bro? Shit, shit, shit. I'm out here in Cali, my nigga. We fuck with you, bro. Hard body, my nigga. Like, real good. Oh, fuck with I just Cali. Got... I fuck with Cali. Yeah, believe that. I gotta get out, that. bro. 
Yeah, get out of here. Come come battle Sway out here, man. Get 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 Sway, get in the ring okay. with Sway, my nigga. Nah, for real, like both of y'all, like everybody rock with here. Sway, man. I don't, hey, man. Y'all yeah, don't make me like, focus on slaves, man. Nah, you know what? It ain't, it, it ain't, it ain't, bro. It's because both of y'all. I mean, you a lot more. You, you, you know, you, you're a big artist and you get respected more. But like, both of y'all, y'all, y'all some, you know, with the wordplay and, and the bars, man, y'all serious. Like, it, right. it'll be, it'll be a good matchup. But my question was like, you know, you you take your little hiatuses and shit. Like, is there a specific reason? Why? You know what I'm saying? And like Because were you, were you like, okay, battle? like this year. Yeah. I I this year like I've been working like on my music lately. You know, I, well period, I've been working on music. Like I've I've battled what six times and I've got put out like six mixtapes, you know what I'm saying? Like the other world, you know, it been it, it helping me out. I've been doing my little shows here that been on tour with Bizarre. So I kinda do both, man. I'm like I'm just a rapper. I'm, i rap, I I do it all. Like, I, if I feel like battling is getting too saturated and boring, I feel like I give my inspiration. I just go with whatever I'm inspired at. Like, okay, I'm inspired to record. I record, and I don't think about how long I'm doing it. I get into the battle world, watch some battles I ain't seen in a couple months. Like, oh, I'm ready to kill somebody. Because after a while, I get an itch to kill, kill a nigga. Cause it's in me. I'm a natural. I'm a natural battler. So after a certain, like I said, I was thinking, like, man, Big T, you you um sell all these records or whatever. Would you battle again? I'm thinking to myself, like, yes. I damn near would. Somebody gotta really talk me out of it because I got the itch to it, and I'm and I came from the battle world. I came from the world of battling how it is today. Like you know, so I so I know what to do still. Right, I need that. I respect that. And what about like, would you ever battle it? Because I know they have to these other leagues and shit. I know you'd be out in Detroit and Google's on shit. Like, would you ever battle on any of these other leagues? Because I know they hit you up and offer you bread and shit. Because you definitely, yeah, yeah, they a, you know, me, they hit me up. But but they hit me up. But if they ain't talking the right numbers, I'm not gonna do it. Because you know, why play in the ABA for less money than the NBA? You feel me? So if that's why. But, but you if I, would. But you would though if the money was right. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I'm not, you know, I'm not gonna battle. I'm not gonna take less money to to battle in the Euro League. You feel me? And the NBA team is good bread. It just don't make sense. That's why I did, my nigga. Well, keep doing your shit, cuz we fucking with you. Uh, Jesse, I see you at Summer Man in the Stream, my nigga. Have your bars ready. <laughs> there you go. You hear yeah, me, fuck boy? Yeah, hit, yeah. hit me up on Twitter. Hit me up on Twitter. <laughs> what? I would set that shit up too. Jesse, I see you getting cocky, man? You getting big headed, Jesse? <laughs> oh no, he was big headed oh, after his first know. battle. After his first battle, he was getting big headed, oh. and this battle calmed him down a little bit, though. <laughs> he brought, mm-hmm. brought his ass back. You know, it's just they they battling you for your views, man. They battling you for your name, man. That's crazy. Oh man, I, I battle. <laughs> yeah, I'm battling yeah, I, I, I know that, but Ooh. I I, I could. I could actually do something in the ring, but not, cycle. So you cycle know what? Just people, be, people are going to try to kill you. Yeah. That's just bring, fucked up. Bring, like they're not going to battle you as far as like taking up the battle. They're going to try to murder you in the ring. Everybody <laughs> in the battle. And you Jesse know, don't realize that. Murder you. It's his own fault. Big, big T, I told this motherfucker, prepare. So I was like, yo, get your, keep, get your shit together. Exactly. This motherfucker wants to sit up here. Like oh, I ain't got to worry about nothing. Look, I got this dude. This dude trash. I'm going to wash him. Watch. I ain't even worried about exactly. it. Exactly. I'm like, yeah, okay. <laughs> exactly. Just, I'm like, you don't know understand. Don't understand. This, I'm like, to him, this is you. This is him battling Lux. Like, yeah, but now, 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 now Psycho's having fun with this, though. Psycho's bringing Cause up. You didn't, yeah, because you didn't listen to me. <laughs> see, see, Jesse don't know. See, this is, this is what you got right now, Jesse, is what battle rappers go through after they lose. It's like a depression. It's a little salty right now. You're salty, so you damn don't like Psycho rubbing it in, Jesse. So now you got to understand, how do you think the guys feel that you damn near was like, oh, he got killed. <laughs> it ain't a good feeling. 
you want you in that foot. Now you know how it feels. So you just not you damn near probably even more considerate now to battle rappers feelings. Cause yes, we do. Have I get I hear what you're saying, but I get what you're saying. But I I never was one to say I was on a luck's caliber. I was always I I was always being like oh, no, well no it, I said first. he was gonna battle you like you was Lux that's what I said like to him no, now no, he no, said no, he no, was battle you but, but, but he was saying that he says now I know how somebody would feel if I if I was giving my opinion I mean if somebody dies I'm still gonna say they died in the ring like I'm not <laughs> uh-huh. Jesse fucked up <laughs> Jesse fucked up over here man so so K shot uh-huh. died. Exactly, Kayshawn died in the ring. My, I thought my <laughs> nigga died in the ring against Big T. <laughs> uh, shit, let's take another call. Let's go uh, 203, you there? Yo. Yo, what's good? What's good, Hip Hop Psycho? What's going on, Zach? It's got 40, what's up, Big T? What up, what's up, this like Connecticut, Hartford or something like that? Not Denver, Hartford, but, Connecticut. Um... Yeah, okay, 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 okay. Yeah, I got okay. a good matchup. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. Far, far. I oh. think you and Lot of Zay oh. would be good. Lot of Zay. Yeah. Bar for bar, I think you, you guys talking would be good. about what Lot of Zay? You hold on, hold on. I'm getting Lot of Zay confused with um my man Sire Boy. Okay, okay, Lot of Zay, Lot of Zay. Yeah, Lot of Zay cool, Lot of Zay cool. But as far yeah, as I think you got to go bar for bar, real good. We think Psycho. You know, a lot of they one of those people I was talking about earlier about like if he just twists his bar one way, it'll be a classic bar. You know, yep. he, he mm-hmm. he's one of those people I was talking about earlier. He got that shit, but it's just like man, he, he don't even need all those punchlines to win the battle. He got he's yeah, almost right. like he almost like beating them over the head with too many punchlines. Like I can see the battle surf. You see, them might have had too many punchlines that battle. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know, sometimes yeah, yeah. It's, a, it's a such thing, bro. It's a such thing. You can have too many bars. You damn it shouldn't be just, you know, you could be punchline. It could get boring. People see here and like this, like that, or you could be like that for, for four minutes. Come on, man. Nah, nah. That shit ain't, ain't going to be crazy like that. But a lot of they, yeah. a lot of they definitely tough, man. A lot of they definitely tough. He's been around for a while too, so you know, I, like like I say, I don't cancel nobody out. Cause people used to try to what's the name, like say that shit to me, like oh man, I never battle you, and now look at me. I say, I can yeah, he's been putting in a lot of work, baby. He's been putting in yeah, a lot of work, baby, yeah, too. Yeah. All right, let's let's go one yeah, so more. You I, never I, know. I, you I never know. A lot of they. I'm saying you need uh, really uh, call, so I'm gonna kill you. What'd say? No, 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 I actually got a quick, quick yeah, question about before well. we get to the next caller, real quick. Uh, yeah, like um, you know, fifty fifty's favorite battle rapper is you. Um, Joe Budden said that his favorite battle rap was Lot of Zay versus Daylight. I mean, what do you feel about an industry cat getting in the ring? I, do you think like a Joe Budden's or Cassidy will hold any? I don't think nah, it's it's not safe. It's not. I don't think it's safe for them, you know, because they right now they 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 gonna have their bars or whatever. But as far as I don't know what they know what, know how to do it, you know, as far as mm-hmm. they don't know exactly what it hit and what not it hit. So let's say some let's say somebody from this culture cross over into the mainstream and come back and battle in it. I think that'll be possible because they did it before. But somebody coming to because it's a fresh new game. This ain't the same battling on the pool table and all that other shit. This is a whole new game. Mm-hmm. So I don't think it'll be smart. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. Now that they was trying to, like, now that their career kind of went down a little bit and they trying to get a spark, other than that, yeah, it'll, it'll yeah. hurt them. They got more yeah, to lose yeah, than yeah, anything. Not, not at the top. Not, the, not, where they at, not where they at the top. No, nah, no, that ain't smart. Yeah, let's try one more call. Let's go. Uh, four two four. You there? Oh, you got to turn your radio down, sir. They got more to lose. He's on delay. Yeah, he, he's not getting off that radio. Um, let's see. Let's go nine seven three. You there? You. 
Yeah, what's good? Yeah, what's up? Big two Jerry. Jerry. Oh, Red. Oh, Red. Oh, Red tough. Huh? I told you, all like, I don't know. That's that. that I, I'm, I'm a streak stopper. He's been on a little run, so shit, it might happen. Yeah, that, that's what you need to take. Red, both of y'all hot, so y'all need to take each other on, man. I'm gonna see old Red and you on that same man stream. Mm-hmm. And I see that nine seven three number called yeah, Jersey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's what. It's... <laughs> yeah, he's Jersey all day. You know, he wants to see old Red and you. I think that'll be a good battle too. I think it'll be, be a good battle. battle too, man. I think that'll be a good battle too. We gonna we gonna find out, man. I, I ain't gonna disappoint some man is three. If if I battle some man is three, which I don't know, but if I, I do, like I'm not gonna up. disappoint. I would like to see you up there because you haven't been on a summer madness stage yet, and that's the one thing you haven't done nah, yet. I, I, would, I would like to see you up there. What? What? Uh, yeah, you got um anything you want to promote anything before we get out of here? Um, well, just the Quiet Money makes they coming out. Hey, everybody go to my website, www.bigtlife.com. That's my website. Leave a message on there. Let me know what y'all thought about Battle Rap Arena. All my music on there. If y'all is not familiar, Big T is the illest to do it. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm working on my projects right now, shooting videos, out here touring with my boy Bazaar. He just did his latest bunch of mixtape. And um, I, um, I'll go watch that video on Tony Toka, Toka Tuesday. I did one of those like a week ago, two weeks ago. Murdered it. Murdered mm. it. But, yeah, just watch out, man. I'm doing it all, man. I got my hand. I'm all around rap. I just do what I do. Battling to making music. Just just watch me. Twitter, at Big TQMB. Tweet me right now. Tell me I ain't shit. I like that type of shit. <laughs> All right, that's what's up. Um, URL's Battle Rap Arena. Check us out next week, Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Thanks again to Big T for coming on and joining us on the show. We out. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Schmidt! skill to be a great MC is just bringing something to the table that no one's seen before. You have to live this lifestyle. You have to train every day. You got to lock in with the bars. That's the training process. You got to go back and watch the game tapes. This is history, man. Um, this went from us battling in stores, the street corners. Now it's, it's to the point where people booking venues, you know, battlers are getting paid for, for, for battling just like an artist would get paid to perform in a concert. I stole my gift, man. I, ain't, I wasn't giving this. I stole it. So I steal yours. <laughs>